<laughs> but y'all can't be around that shit, period, though, either. Man. But I know, but I ain't even trying to get ahead of nothing. I'm 30. Talk about. I'm 30, bro. All right. <laughs> it's legal. Motherfucker got to live their life. Bro. All right, bet, 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 bet. I just don't want to be smoking, and they be like, he mind, you was on 85 South Show. Mm-mm. That's the difference. That's what I was telling him. I'm like, gee, I'm, I can't forever be a basketball player with the right. shit. Like, it's like. But I don't want to help you break the rules. No, I ain't breaking the rules. That's what I'm saying. I ain't finna come on this motherfucker smoking. He said oh. we was chilling, folks. Right, right, right. More definitely, more definitely. I'm just saying, even when we smoking, we smoking. Y'all, that's okay, y'all cool, grown cool, ass cool, thing. Cool, you got cool, kids. Cool. I know, but you know how they big. They some whole ass nigga, bro. I'm gonna I'm I'm get on that cut ass out Look, for you. Listen, I'm not under contract. I'm a free agent. Oh. They know as I come in that motherfucker, either you fuck with me or you don't. Bro. Say no more, man. Damn. Either you trust me to guard this nigga and you trust me to knock these shots. Whether down. he musty or not, <laughs> tuck your shit. <laughs> Give him on the mustiest nigga on the team. Real talk. He gonna check him. That the is. nigga who don't bang. He gon' check him. He gonna go crazy on him. That's what you came up with. Rich musty nigga. <laughs> Six different soaps and you musty. Nigga. That's, a, that's what you got out of that. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie, cause we need you. Atlanta Hawks, we need you. Oh man, I'll be at service, bro. I'll be at service. Hope y'all niggas watch. Boy, it. I'm so through with Atlanta sports right now, I can't believe you got a Falcon hat on. The only reason, Boy. listen, Lord. we could we could be a fucking, I don't give a fuck what symbol we have. We could be anything. I'm just repping Atlanta. I ain't repping that damn team. You hear me? They getting on my fucking nerve, bro. Boy. 20. Did you see them watching? Let me show you what they did. Let me show you what they did. Onside kick. <laughs> nigga, nigga, watch the nigga. They counted the yards. The ball done went 15 yards. They get what they do. They went back and put, put the nigga in front of the ball. Can't stand y'all motherfuckers, man. Yeah, I don't know how that happened. How we lose, Lo? I think they said they, they was taught to go to a man. Hey, man. Falcons going Falcon. Boy. That's I all I can tell you. I ain't even got over make sense team. to you. <laughs> I ain't got over 283 yet. Who your team? I ain't got over 283 yet. I'm a free agent right now. Fuck that shit. You feel me? I ain't, I'm not, I'm, I'm seeing other teams right now. Talk your shit. I'm, I ain't gonna I'm lie, taking I'm these games that. one at a time. I'm fucking with that. I ain't even gonna hold you. Anyone? What draft? You say anybody, anybody can prepare? I'm finna, I'm finna send my letter. Let's go train tomorrow. Let's go send our letters in. I'm finna go crazy. The Hawks need you. The Hawks need all three of us. I'm gonna be the coach. Even if I never got in the game, you know how many tickets I would sell? <laughs> I'm used to that, so I ain't even tripping. Think about that <laughs> shit. Nigga, if they should fuck with me on a business standpoint. What? <sighs> I'm used to not getting in. I don't give a fuck. Put me in the far end seat. How many endorsements I get? EA Sports. It's in the game, but I'm not. But I'm on the game. Oh, okay, okay, okay. More for cold. I'll be the first nigga on another nigga cover. What'd you say? I'll be the first nigga on another nigga cover. <laughs> he on that bitch about to yam. I'm in the background standing up like a motherfucker. <laughs> His shit hologram. My shit hologram too. This shit is like draft day, fuck. We got this. <laughs> Draft day drum. It was like a heart. You did. Boy, what the fuck is that? What? Oh, I ain't done. I got some more. Titties in the titties in the building. Oh, look, Country Wayne yeah. just said I got that, I got that fire. Titties your old ass. Yeah. See, I know, I know what y'all trying. That's why you, okay. Your I'm old ass saying. ain't gonna come up here and try to make loads look good. Titties in the titties in the building. I'm just saying, why is it in that little ass bag? Because it's the end. Why this, are you savoring that though? That because you first of all, I was sleep, motherfucker. <laughs> I didn't even know we was doing this shit. So this is the last little bit that I had in my car that I found. I just came from off the road, so this shit was there before I went on the road. So this that ooh, you found me weed, you know what I'm mean? saying? <laughs> That's that. What is this? Oh shit. Okay, we got like two days left. I, I can do a little something with that. I'm do a little something with that. Huh? That's that, hey, you found me. You better hurry up and smoke me. <laughs> Cause you got two days before I turn into ash. <laughs> that shit was 
shit going to evaporate. That's that why I got a little bit to go with it, you know what I'm saying? Put it on top, you know what I'm saying? Put a little sprinkle on top. I mean, you got a diamond, too bad. <laughs> you can tell, because okay, it got green color all on the bag. <laughs> it's been in there for a while, it's okay. <laughs> That's what happened when you got more kids, man. You just can't run into the weed, man, like that, like that. Oh my God. Uh, what is wrong with me? Smoking this gas. It's about a week old. Uh, it's my last. Right. But it's gonna get old. Oh, uh, so we gotta get smoked. Right, right. And it gotta get rough. Yeah. I'm gonna tell you right now. Right. I'm gonna be hot on the floor. Hey. <laughs> That's a bar, though. I'm gonna be out on the phone. Hey, <laughs> that's a bar. What the fucking Falcons know? <laughs> you let them watch the ball and kick the field goal. <laughs> you let them watch the ball and kick the field goal. What they do, bro? You let them watch the ball and kick the field goal. <laughs> you let them watch the ball and kick the field goal. Yeah. When it stands like no. Right. Right. We can't control. No. No. We emotional. Hey, hey. We hate you, foe. <laughs> Matt Ryan. Ooh. I ain't gonna say what I wanna say about Matt. That shit have made the news. Boy. I'm gonna just look at you like an old nigga. <laughs> Matt, if you watching this, I'm ooh. I'm speaking man, I'm with my eyes. Damn man, that's the fabulous, bro. <laughs> God, I'm sitting there. I'm talking big shit. Oh, they gotta get a stick, sir. Oh, they ain't even trying. Oh, the Falcons ain't got to do these boys like this. Oh, God, slap the blunt out your head. Man, they hit the flow. That's <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying. Like, oh, this shit gonna still get smoked. You got me fucked up. <laughs> Damn, it's over with. <laughs> You know how I like spread it out and shit? You if you bring it together, it's dust yeah, all in there, man. <laughs> <laughs> you about to have dirt and everything. Like. I'ma have dirt weed. I ain't smoking that shit. <laughs> I, I just gotta just gotta just do it. <laughs> Damn, man. Flat. My nigga, man. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I was telling you that. <laughs> and y'all was just waiting too. They be like, boy, wait till he see this shit. I look. Bro, I was just tell that why I see it, man. Bro, out there the sack. I'm like, man, come on, shit. Oh my goodness. Right. There you go. You can have some of this. Hey. Oh, shit. Boy. Boy. That's how you start the day, man. Hey, my boy. The day, okay. He didn't give me a lot, he just replaced with hit the flow. That was up. Nah, I can't. That, that was up. That was up. I'm trying to mix it. I'm a prisoner. I'm trying to mix it. I'm a prisoner. Nick said, I'm gonna give you what hit the flow, okay. Hey, you know what's funny? We can't even start till we get to the part where you ain't touching no weed. Gee, he playing beats. <laughs> oh, man. We are not in the studio. That's what I'm saying. This shit feel like it, though. No. We are, but we ain't. What this you shit, wanna do to this? This shit do. It feel like it. It feel like it. <laughs> yeah. Look. Yeah. He gonna start I, it off. Uh. I'ma start it out. Got a roll, my son. Ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I got a smoke, my son. Just to get in my meditation. Fuck around, I'ma get it on rotation. You will fuck around, uh, let it rotation. I ain't trying to get it on probation. Uh. Yeah, uh, get it. Stick See, it. that's how you drop get the last it. weed. Uh. See, uh. that's how you drop the last weed. Uh. See, uh. That's how you drop the last weed, uh, bouncing all around while you're trying to roll up. Nigga, uh, be still. Nigga, just hold up, cuz uh, she. I can't. Yes, you can. My body be moving, I can't. <laughs> it won't, won't stop. I'm trying to roll it to the top. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Look at your braids, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> hey, man, nigga, head bitch is tight, too, what the fuck? No, man, nigga, 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 nigga. No. He said he combed him out. I can tell, because you ain't never had braids before. And them bitches is like, they don't even look like braids. <laughs> look like surgery wounds, you good? <laughs> they close this shit back up. <laughs> hey, hey, man. I started asking that nigga, are you okay, J.O.N.? What's wrong? 
Oh, you didn't tell me. <laughs> it's the third procedure. That nigga got his shit braided look younger. <laughs> oh, Ted, you know why I seen the uh, comment? They were like, ain't nobody gonna say nothing about J.O.N. Dread. I said, what the fuck? They made be, me go look. I don't be looking at the nigga. That's fucked up. Cause every time I look over there, he doing some weird shit. Nigga have on a pink do-rag, a hoodie, and some bullshit. I be like, I don't know what that nigga got going on. I don't trust nigga with shades, cause you don't never observe them. You just be like, oh, they go nigga with shades. <laughs> I just I ain't even know he had that shit. Nigga snuck and changed hairstyles like a bad bitch. <laughs> like season 16, I'ma reveal oh, this man. shit. <laughs> Hold up, but how you take your dreads out? I thought they were locked. Exactly. <laughs> he did it himself. That, that nigga combed that shit that out. Nigga left one little part unloose. Nah, well, one day we'll take it out. Just don't, don't twist it all the way. My arm is tired. His elbow is burning. How you take dreads out? Now you put condition in this comb. For real? Told you. Hold on, hold on, my nigga. That's some shit you gotta do by yourself. He did that. You took your dreads out one by one. Cut, cut the music down, nigga. Don't try to over, uh, under talk the music. Yeah, yeah man, you know, I just tried to do it one by one. Yeah. yeah. Trying to be smooth. Nigga, like he Ray John. Yeah. I just wanna do it one by one, you know? <laughs> trying to talk on beat and shit. How you do that? Nah, fool, you just take a little conditioner water, take a comb, and just comb it out one by one. One by one. Okay, so what was the, like, how long did it take? It took about a month. About a month? Yeah. That shit nigga, took we, about we, a month. I don't even remember. We've been recording. This nigga been right here. Was they that long? Oh, so you? Oh, so your shit was half split, and you had on the. Oh, okay. He knew not to let you see that shit. Yeah, he knew not. But I don't like I don't how know he, tried why. To he let me see that shit. Today. Like that was gonna be even better. I like the dreads. That shit right there, some bullshit. Don't do him like that, man. He just I'm his friend. I wouldn't allow him to walk around and be having that in the back of my mind like, boy, that nigga braids is some bullshit. Nah, that, nah them his new braids. At least wait till they get old. Well, his new braids is some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's driving? That my boy, the dread gave him that sauce. He gonna start talking different. Don't talk different, J.O.N. <laughs> Cause you know when you feel ugly, you start to really feel ugly. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, man. He trying to, hey, man. <laughs> he trying to get his confidence back. He gonna lose it. You see how he tried to have a whole reveal and shit? <laughs> and it scared us. <laughs> I ain't know the nigga even. I didn't know his dreads was that long where it was gonna take a month to take the shit out. I didn't even know you could take dreads out. I, I thought you just had to cut them. I didn't either. Yeah. When I found out I did. What you do with the residue? <laughs> Put it in the bag. Are oh, you gonna keep them? For real? You gonna get rid of the dread? And you gonna keep the braid? Nah, he ain't. He lying. He lying. You think a nigga that won't oh, so you cut the you say you cut the, <laughs> So you say you gotta cut the end? <laughs> he lying. Cause you if he cut was the gonna end? get rid of him, no, he would have already. He said he, say he gonna donate his hair to a nigga who won't have. He said a nigga gonna buy. You what? You think a nigga go buy all that dandruff in the What make bread? you think a nigga ain't gonna ask for him? It's gonna be a nigga in the comment. Hey, bro, let me get them bitches. <laughs> it gonna be you, Lowe. You gonna tax them. You gonna be like, you no, real I'm serious not. about that? I do them. not want them. I know what them dreads be. I might do something with them. <laughs> Lowe's gonna come in there with a full dread. He be like, hey, DC. What does that mean, man? He lying, nigga. What does that mean? He be like, shit, Chico, uh, nigga. Everybody doing something new, goddamn. I'm like, oh, hell nah. I never do no we, shit, nigga. We gotta get back on the road, boy. Y'all gotta lose y'all mind, boy. <laughs> I'm gonna cover this bitch. I'm gonna have a whole skit. I'm like, I might as well. <laughs> Niggas just trying shit. I know where them dreads were, man. I seen what that nigga did in them bitches. I wouldn't buy them. Mm -mm. <laughs> I wouldn't even buy them. I they know what he did. Energy. I seen them. Bro, they ain't gonna be walking bro. like J.O.N. <laughs> What's, What's up, DC? up, Jive What's up, What's up, man? I'm like, man, this shit. Bro. Going down. They gonna throw me on cocaine, man. man. This hey, man, is. welcome back to the 85 South Show. <laughs> we are in here. This is the VIP Trap Edition. DC Young Fly, how you feeling? Thank you, man. Bless, man. Just trying to stay healthy out here in these streets. I I'm talking about that. Corona, but <sighs> these niggas, they don't know what's going on. Hey, man, we got oh, a special okay. guest in the trap house with us today. Who we got? Who we got? Come on, man. You don't know him? They're my partner. You bullshit. I'm saying, but bro, like, bro, everybody know bro, man. Nigga, we done got music going. They're my nigga. I told you, yeah, You know what I mean? I told him we were doing music. I said, boy, fuck these niggas. So about fuck it. all the other shit. They just like, just the music shit. Man, shout out to God. So I ain't even got to say the other shit, dude. Oh, 
on, you gotta say it. Yeah, you gotta say it. Talk your shit. Championship. Championship. Take, nigga. Yeah. Nigga. Yeah. Nigga. Yeah. I wanted you to say it, cause you don't never get to say it. I don't. I don't. I don't but Big ring. Big ring. Tell him. Right. Tell him all that shit. They can say whatever they want, but you gotta mention me as a champion. Mmm. Got you. Mmm. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Everybody in the champion. Chop off. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I said even, you know what I'm saying? You ain't you have to call my name. Bro. Do you uh, say you ain't have to call my bro, name? You, I done heard it all, man. I done heard it. You making history right now. Look, Mazda hit me with the, oh, y'all, man, Kyrie won y'all championship. I was there. Pull it out. Y'all, Pull they, it out. They played other years without me. They could win championships all the time. I was part of the championship team. Don't, bro. don't let that shit bother you. went right back to the thing right after they, right after we was gone. Don't y'all let that know. shit bother you. was passing that nigga the ball. I it seen don't you. even matter. I'm saying no matter what they say, it's champion. You champion. got a motherfucker got sitting you. up in the, in, the, in the glass. Yeah, my daddy got it. The big motherfucker. A lot of people ain't got that. <laughs> You gotta promise your look. You gotta promise to kill yourself something. I'm telling you. I said I was going. I was going hoop, and I was going rap, and I was going win a championship, and I was going buy my mama a house. Fucking right. My mama, I said that shit. She got, she got the, uh, the little what you call. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm seeing you that. That's good media content. Real story, shit. Real story. Bro, we ain't even finished the intro. The look. The, oh my bad. 85 South Show. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> 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 what the fuck, fuck you lie. You did. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Mon Show. You know it. How you living, G? I'm good. I'm good. Welcome I'm to good. the trap. You're the first uh, NBA champion to come to our trap house, man. Look at yeah. Marvin. No, that lit. Look at Marvin Gaye no, looking at lit. you, boy. That's the first time Marvin smiled at him, boy. boy. Look, he fucked with you, alone. He's proud of you, boy. He fucked with you. He fucked with you. He give me the. He like the hell. What? You done brought the man in here. <laughs> you did. What's been going on, man? No, nah, man, I just, uh, long summer, everybody going through the corona shit, but uh, it just been a long summer working out, getting my body back right. I had to take care of something with a surgery with my knee. Um, I found out I was playing on it for a year and a half, two years, I had a tear in it. But mm. we thought, because I had other knee surgeries, it looked on the MRI like it was just, you know what I'm saying, from them other surgeries that mm-hmm. it just, I didn't have as much of a meniscus and it come to find out it was like a bucket handle in it. I should have got it fixed, but I was just toughing it out. Cause I was like, maybe I'm just getting old. Like, right. <laughs> See, that's so I just, for real. I just Bro, kept playing. Athlete shit. I just the kept playing. The average nigga had that type of problem. He can't even get up and go to work and yeah, not playing no just, fucking basketball. Well, my, I, I, I know you know, sure. notice your boosters ain't working and shit. Like, I ain't I never had none. I, <laughs> like my brakes wasn't working. <laughs> you thought I, yeah, you like you can see some plays. You can see some plays where I like have mo- I had moves where I would do some, mm-hmm. and I'm supposed to like you can see like why he ain't just go through his legs and just go. Right. And I do it, and my leg ain't moving fast, and I had to pull that bitch back. For real? <laughs> and that motherfucker ain't coming back. Like what? No, about, I had to pull like a joint some shit. Like say you say I'm. Well, no, this, don't do the shit. Yeah, this don't shit. Don't do shit. Look. No, don't, don't, Ooh, no, I'm good now. That's no, what I'm saying. Do like, shit. I'm good, good now. I know, but don't. Like, I'm, I, you know what I'm saying? I got my boosters back. I'm just ready. Look in the rim again. And you ready, know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just relaxed on the couch. That's what I'm saying. Shit. But, I believe dog. you, my nigga. But yeah, I tried to, you know what I'm saying, stop on a dime and turn, but right. I couldn't push off because it'd like be uncomfortable. But I'm like, I ain't finna be like on some, oh, I got a problem with my knee because yeah, I was trying to tough it out. out. Yeah, I was just trying to hoop. But we, you know what I'm saying? I felt like I still played well. That's why I was like, I don't know how I did it, but. Hey, I got it fixed now, so I'm back you on y'all ass. You did that. Oh, but as a champion, though, like, how does it feel? Because you know that's the ultimate goal. When motherfuckers mm-hmm. go to the NBA, you want to be a champion. You feel what I'm saying? Like, how did it feel when them got there and the confetti started coming out and shit with hitting y'all on the face like a script? How did that shit feel? That's crazy. Yeah, you, I yeah. I can't just be a male in the Nah, nigga, you got hit like a script with hey. <laughs> Like, yeah. came down on everybody. No, nah, but it, it was. I ain't gonna lie, and the confetti made it, you know what I'm saying, like, it make it real, like, even having, like, the champagne, the locker right. room, like, we had goggles for right. it, like, it was just fun as hell to, like, see everybody that happy, but to see everybody, like, finally get a chance to be weak, mm. you know what I'm saying, yeah, like, right, right. the whole time, everybody just, Ugh! and then at the end, everybody was like, thank you, <laughs> while I was, was hugging, we falling on the floor, like, oh. Oh, like it just, it felt like all the F finally came back into the room, bro. Right. Like you could finally breathe again. Like, but it make all that shit worth it. All the sprints, all the like achy nights, the nights you don't be with your family. Like people don't be thinking about that, but that should be hard, bro. Like 
know what I'm yeah, saying? Way. 14 day road trips. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah, we gonna do athlete shit and go out and go to dinner and people gonna take Peace pictures of us. Yeah, shit like fun. we gonna do that just so we ain't gotta sit in a hotel room. Right. But it's like, for real, for real, like I know it's a bunch of great dudes in the league and moms be like FaceTiming their kids. Like right. y'all took a cool ass picture of us walking into the restaurant, but we at the table, moms FaceTiming their kids and shit, right. like wanting to, wanting to be around them. So it's like, finally winning the championship and then you come back to your wife and you like, this why, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, this, this why we why wasn't we around. Going. Yeah, right, this right, why right. I'm doing six hour days. This why eight hours out the day it seemed like, damn, you stay at the gym, you going back again? You finna shoot tonight? It's like, yeah, I shot it bad. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn, after the game, fool, I'm waiting for you at, the, you shooting this shit? Gotta like, be great, you gotta be great. But it'd be like, gee, yeah, you got the repetition, just seeing the ball go in, having the confidence to shoot that shit and, and miss that shit for real, for real. That's all NBA is, like, you got a bunch of dudes that got the balls to say, I'm gonna come out here and play defense, and if he crossed the shit out of me, like I'll take that chance, and yeah. everybody can laugh at me, cool. But them the minds that go get it, the mind that's gonna jump and do a crazy dunk on the breakaway, like yeah. you may miss that, <laughs> yeah, right? It <laughs> yeah. looks stupid than a mother, but do you got the balls to come back again and try it again and make it? Right. Because that's all they gonna remember. They not gonna remember the miss. You right. know what I'm saying? Yeah. They probably gonna remember my I shot that one off the glass. Yeah. They gonna remember that forever. Yeah, I remember that. Dude. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you gonna remember that? Do you remember Steph doing it? No. That's crazy, right? Right. Steph shot at least 15 of them. Mm. You see what I'm saying? Like, but I know what he did, dude. He fucked up in the playoffs. <laughs> yeah. Nigga. Damn. I hold niggas accountable. No, but I'm saying, I'm saying though, it's it's just crazy that a fan, like, right. you gonna remember when he had the balls to do it again. But you know what I do remember over the shot, though? <laughs> there you go. But you know what I do remember over the shot? What that? You a champion. Oh, for sure that. You can't forget that. You get what I'm saying? Fuck you can't forget that. I fucked you too, though, Steph, but I lost a lot of money no, that day. Oh, Steph that got, that's, that's what makes Steph good, Joe. He'll go out there and shoot an air ball from 40 feet. And right. everybody be like, why the hell you shoot that? And then he'll make one, and now you got to guard him 40 feet from the basket. So any move he do going to get you. Like, you ain't got to right. guard him. I usually got to guard niggas at three point line. I got to guard Steph at half court. Right. He you got to guard that nigga. He Every may one. shoot it from the logo. That right. nigga shoot. He may shoot it from out of bounds, motherfucker. He yeah. may. <laughs> they may. Do you know what I'm saying? And, right. we, and, and we be sitting there looking at the ref like, what, what is that? Is that out of bounds? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What is Can that? See Can he do I that? I always want to play basketball, and I'm just like, ooh, I get to ask this nigga all my favorite basketball <laughs> questions. That's what I told that nigga. His hoop dream. Came true. He I'm talking about nigga, you know, moved. Whole story. Nigga, that nigga, you did it for us. <laughs> nigga, you made it out the hood. Why hooping? What? That was an ultimate goal for me, but yeah. I done seen myself doing that shit. Like, so look, okay, when you out there and you hooping, right? Because I know it politics. Like, what defers niggas from being them type of guys when they going in and they handling their business and taking out their energy and control the game versus you just going out there being like a, 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 a rope, like a, like a, uh, What's the dude with the braid? Don't say his name. What the dude with the braid? This is the dude with the what braid. What the dude with the braid? He, play, he used to play for the Spurs, but he played for the long, um, got an ugly laugh. Kawhi? Yeah, Kawhi. Like, see, he don't really got no emotion. <laughs> he don't really got no emotion when he play. He just play good and just go sit down. Yeah. But see, like somebody like somebody with sauce that go in there and do their thing and they just take over the whole game and like what the first people from being that type of player and just, just wanna go in there and play the game. Miles really is that's who they are. Right. Like Kawhi off the court is just like that. He chill. He don't really want a lot of attention. He trying to go through the back. You know what I'm saying? Right. He ain't really trying to be bothered. Talk to people like that. He stay with his, you know what I'm saying? That's who he is. Like it's cool. Right. You got somebody like like Bron. Mm-hmm. Bron loves, he, he, he explained to us even while we was playing together, he like, I love, like, cause I do too, I love the energy of a game. Like, I love the trash talk, I love the almost fighting. Yes. I, li I like the fight or flight feeling, like, yes. you know what I'm saying? I'm addicted to it. I'm, I like that moment at the end of the game when your best player got the ball and I'm supposed to stop him and everybody like, yeah, like, I got my money on that. Yeah. Fuck that. You see what I'm saying? Chuck, don't let that nigga go left. Yes, sir. Don't let him go. Yes, sir. That's my, that's, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Everybody, yeah. Yes, sir. That's Let's my go. Thing. Fuck that nigga. That's, that's what I hear. Like, yes, sir. The end of the game, I live for that moment. Like, oh, shit, it's on me. Let's yes, go. sir. It's on me. Bet. It's on me. But it's like, you got somebody like Bron that, like, I want to be in that seat. Like, he get the end of the game on the other side. Mm. Like he the other side looking at me, you see what I'm saying? Like I love that side too, it's just 
who I had to play with coming in. I, I got Melo, Stat, wait your turn, Sean. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Trade out, Bron, you got to wait your turn, Sean. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? It, it sucks because niggas is like, Bron, 16, 17 years in. It's like, yeah, but he's slowing down, so wait yeah. your turn, G. Till he run out, like till he stop going to the ship, like we kind of gotta let him rock. And it's, it was hard to grow with with shit like that. To be like, when am I gonna take a end of the game shot? Like, right. I love doing that. High school, uh, college, like I love that moment. But you might got getting to that, to that that role. You know what I'm saying? And Miles gotta be cool with that and get stuck in the love. So that part, that's that's my championship. You see mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, Bobby, like, you like defense? No, nah, I kind of just like that part. <laughs> <laughs> I like I like pressure, and I like everybody being like, he got balls, because yeah. I just, I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, I would love to be on the other side of it, like, yeah. Yes, <laughs> yeah, I would love to have 25 shots a game to be like, nah, now nah, I ain't finna shoot these corner threes. I'm gonna shoot what I wanna shoot. Right. You, you know what I'm saying? Choose. I'm gonna yank you how I wanna yank you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I get to call the screens and shit, like, Ain't gonna be all that. Maybe I don't like playing like that. I like playing like this, and this is how we run it. You see what I'm saying? Like, I, that's why I love point guard. When I came in, I was a point guard. I had to go to move to three. I tore my ACL. They, man, we got Raymond Felton. We got this guy. You know, he came back early, slide to two. You know what I'm saying? That, oh, you can guard two through four. Pfft, put him at three. Fuck it. Put Melo at four. I kind of figured that. I'm like, how the hell you yeah, ended up becoming the three? And I was like, yeah, I don't know where he was at at first. I'm high. I'm just watching. You got oh, yeah. This shit lit. Go ahead. Go ahead. This you shit you lit. Know? Keep talking. This shit 30 for 31. This yeah, 30, it's 30 for 30. Hey, welcome back for 31 for 31. Uh, this is the ghetto edition, man. Get, you ain't got to say shit. Just keep talking your shit, bro. I'm telling you. We'll get to the shit in a minute. Keep going, bro. No, it just. Bro, you got to get trapped in, like, whatever it is for that ring, like, and that's what I got trapped in. Like, sometimes I wish, like, I could go back and be like, man, when I came back from ACL and I wasn't playing point guard, I should have just pulled how these young, they, they just be like, they'll go to the media and be like, I should be playing point guard, I want to trade. Like, <laughs> mm. I'm like, gee, maybe I should have just told my agent, like, yeah, tell them trade me if I ain't going back to the one. I ain't playing to. But some about me was like, no, nah, like they going to, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to play two for the rest of this year. They're going to throw me back to one. What? You know what I'm saying? After that, I get my chance to go. You know what I'm saying? Right. But it was like, we got coach change. They got different plans for it. They see it different. It's like my, my draft GM wasn't there. So it was like my shit went that way. So it's politics like that for real? It ain't really, it wasn't really politics. It's just situation. Like if, right. now bro draft me. You know what I'm saying? He like, yeah, I'm the GM. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you, you a good GM. I got you. You see what I'm saying? You a good GM. Yeah, what you need? You a good GM. So he, <laughs> he draft. Get him what he wants. He draft, he draft me, right? Right. And he tell me that, like, yeah, this your team, Sean. Ooh, we got this head coach right here. Right. All right, so he my head coach. Right. Wow, he like, cool, I love Iman at the one. I love playing a big point guard. Boom, ha, right. ha, ha. We have a, a season where we ain't doing too well. He got to make a change. Before he want to make the change, they fire him. Mm. Now he the coach. Right. But he always seen me in college as like, I don't really think he a point guard. Right, right, right. I think he a two. Right. I want him to score. He athletic. He's strong. Right. I want him to guard the two guard, too. I don't think I want him pressuring the one all the time. Mm. I want to play a smaller one. So mm -hmm. he go throw me at the two. But he coming in like, you know what I'm saying? He just like, in my mind, just works. So right. he mom run that. So it's like, I could either be the disobedient child that's like, <laughs> right, right. I ain't doing that shit. And I always looked at other people and been like, bro, why you be doing that, bro? Right. We trying to win. Like, what is it to niggas? You know what I'm saying? And then I looked at the career wise. So sometimes I go back and be like, man, I wish I would have been a little dickhead about it. Like, right. but would I have been a champion? Mm, see what I'm saying? You know what say saying? that shit again. Say that one more time. Like, niggas <laughs> just say that one more time. <laughs> like, one more time. I could have been that guy that like pouted until you gave me my 25 shots and I might have been an all-star whatever, like mm -hmm. I could have got that that lane, but mm -hmm. would I have been a champion? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. I don't know. Cause I still, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like I had knee injuries, like I had shit happen. And I, I used to wake up from surgeries cause you know, after the first couple surgeries, like you get used to it. And then right. you like, you, I'm waking up from surgery, I'm calling the Uber. They, they like, you got somebody to pick you up? Uh. Rob, you know what I'm saying? I could get to the auto. Like, <laughs> and yeah. they surgery be like overnight. Y'all niggas be back Type shit. playing But tomorrow. it's like, I got damn near used to it where I'm just like, <laughs> it's just part of it now. Ah, oh, shoulder pop out. I got, ah, fuck it. Let's God go. damn, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Finger mess up. Ah, psh, fix it. Let's go. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I was prepared for that shit. Yeah, my shit, don't even, my shit ain't even straight no more.
But it's crazy because it's actually stronger now. Mm. Yeah, it should be, nigga. Yeah, you got a hook. So it be motherfucker that be getting that shit popped on the side and they be had to go that in there. That bitch got a groove yeah. in it. Yeah. Yeah. You got, you got, you got, to do that, they'll go to the bench, they'll pop it back in place, wrap it up, tape it with your other finger, and you could play. They just make sure it's no structural damage, you know what mm. I'm saying? You could deal with like the sting of it after a couple of hits and your adrenaline kick in, you mm-hmm. straight. Man, you trying to win. Yeah. But it's like, I don't think anybody in the league is healthy. Like, Braun, all these guys that you see, like, Braun takes care of his body the best, but he still feels it. Right, yeah, He just yeah. plays. You know Ooh. what I'm saying? Yeah, right, you got to right. play through something. Like, I, Mons be having hot packs on. People don't understand what they putting their body through. Like, you putting your body through some shit. Right. It look nice. <laughs> <laughs> going out there oh, going it look crazy. crazy. Like practicing. Okay. Hey, what's up? What's going on? Is there something preventing you from finding your true happiness in life? Would you like to speak to a professional who may be able to help you? BetterHelp will assess your needs and match you with your own licensed professional therapist. You can start communicating in under 48 hours. It's not a crisis line. It's not self-help. It is professional counseling done securely online. There's a broad range of expertise available, which may not be locally available in many areas. The service is available for clients worldwide. You can speak to a professional online so you don't have to be uncomfortable or be in an awkward situation speaking to somebody who may be able to address the issues you may or may not have. So seek help. Go to betterhelp.com. It's online. BetterHelp is committed to facilitating great therapeutic matches so they make it easy and free to change counselors if needed. It's more affordable than traditional offline counseling and financial aid is available. Visit betterhelp.com backslash 85 south that's better h-e-l-p and join over 1 million people taking charge of their mental health with the help of an experienced professional special offer for 85 south show listeners get 10 percent off your first month at betterhelp.com backslash 85 south here are some testimonials i really appreciate jennifer's empathy and kindness I feel heard and supported. She has offered some really helpful practices. Hey, make sure you visit betterhelp.com backslash 85 South. I think I'm still it. stuck on the surgery shit. Like this oh yeah, I wake up from surgery, G, and I was just like, damn, like why I keep having to get surgery, Joe? Like why? I felt like I was getting so many surgeries. I'm like, gee, why am I, should I just switch up how I hoop? Like, <laughs> should I play different, bro? Should I stop? Diving on the floor and doing all this wild shit. Like, what was the main? What was the like main surgery like you kept getting that you seen and just kept being like repetitive? You just had the, the cleanups with my knees, like just a little cleanup surgery. Sometimes it wasn't even a surgery. Like I'm having problem problems. It's right. just like swellings happening. Get an MRI. Mm, inflammations and shit. Yeah, like that. A little stuff. But it was like it was small cleanups and shit that I had to get <clears> after <throat> this uh, ACL that was just like damn near maintenance you got to get like visco shots just taking care of it right. you know what i'm saying get your your blood spun uh put back in bone marrow transplants you know what i'm saying like it's it just shit like just that. little shit to just keep yourself re- the regeneration of your knees bringing back everything you know so when you get like surgery like the moment you go through surgery do like the team start looking at you different because now you went under the knife like, you know, I they think start so. looking at the surgery, so. you know, and people kind of like different. I think so. I think on the business side of things, if you was if you were just a businessman, right, and you like take this guy, 26, never had surgery, no problems, right. nothing, right. I don't know how much I'm gonna use this guy that I'm about to sign, but right. I got this guy. He 30. He been through a couple surgeries. Hmm. That's how niggas, I think that's how they look at it sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Like, you won't see the difference in the two. What? Right. Until the playoffs hit. Talk your shit. No, no, for real. Like, it be, it be cool to have anybody with you until the war come. And then it be like, mm, yeah, you might, y'all might want to sign something over there. Right. Y'all might want to go pick him up. <laughs> he ain't going for that. <laughs> that you playing for real. All that, yeah, all that out the window. That cool shit be gone. Like, it be like, all right. It's time to play now. We gotta play. We gotta beat them four times. Yeah, come get it. E- Iman, come on. <laughs> Talk your shit. Come Cause on. they need you. Come on, man. The Hawks do. <laughs> but they be, I'm just saying, like, you, I look different on paper when it's the playoffs. Yeah. Like during the regular season. You do play way better than the playoffs, my nigga. Yeah. I, 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 I do say that. But it's you gotta in the playoffs, 
in, you not doing during the regular season, bro. I may play. You got to think. I'm always gonna guard the best player. Right. They do. They do. They do. How you doing that? Take me in Cleveland. Right. Say we go on the West Coast. Mm-hmm. We go play Sacramento. Mm-hmm. The Kings. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. We go play the Clippers. Yeah. I'm gonna chase Chris Paul through at least a hundred ball screens. Right. That that's back when I was playing with Cleveland. I'm saying. Yeah. Cause right, they damn so, sure you. And then you're going to have L.A., who back then, who we had. Um, that was when Cole was Yeah, I think that was when Cole was there. Yeah. Who else was with him? Nobody. No, no, no. Cole was, Cole might have been hurt. But he was, yeah, I think he was still on the team. He might have been hurt. But mm-hmm. I'm going to have to guard who was over there. D'Angelo Russell. I'm going to have to, I'm gonna have to chase somebody. Him. That's cool. That man could put it in the hoop. Mm-hmm. Right, I'm done thinking about the snitch shit. Oh, yeah. He can play. But, he can you know, play his ass. He so. definitely can play. I don't know why he did that. I don't know why he did that either, but he definitely can play. G Code. I don't know why he did G-Code. that. G Code. That's, that's all not I'm even, saying. That's not even how he give it up. The Dude. times I've been around him, that ain't how he gave it up. But that's, he just ain't had the right yeah, chance. He, I don't you know, know what. He tripped out. Any who. Any right. That ain't, that ain't no new shit. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I might have to guard him. And I might have two good games. And then we may play Golden State where it's a TNT game. Mm-hmm. I may not have nothing left. Right. I, I got to chase Steph now and Clay. I'm not. I probably wouldn't shoot it the best. Right. You know they use you to tie them out. Not even that. They know that's my job. Right. And when I get exhausted like that, my job is to tell niggas like, "Hey, G. I'm gonna make sure that he can't get off, but I'm feeling it." Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's where like the game get different for niggas. Like, when you got the playoffs now. I could do that. I'm icing, but I'm playing you again. I don't have to guard a whole new style. Right. I got the same to, style for the same. So now they locked you down. You want to play ball screen? We going to play ball screen. Right. Okay. You going you gonna to screen dirty. Perfect. Bit. I'll see you Saturday. <laughs> you know right. what I'm saying? Right, right, right. That's cool. Like, I'm going to go ahead and go him and then go I ain't going to argue with the ref and make it a scene no more. I'm not doing that no more. I have an issue with this man. We'll deal with it, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, we'll, we'll get to that. That's all. And then you go out there and play. I, I'm going to ice up. Like, I know. Okay, cool. They hitting that. They're going to make sure they hit my right hip. They think I can't slide right. All right, mm-hmm. cool. I see what they on. Don't trip. I, I see what you on. But it's like, p- some people don't look at the game like that. Some people look at the game like, did I make my shots? Did I miss my shots? I, I promise Do this, you. I don't look at it like that. I be looking at it like, damn. So Steph going to start every attack through the legs. Mm-hmm. Damn. Mm-hmm. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Kimball Kimba going to do a step back now. He in a step back rhythm, so he, he on his step back. So if I take away his step, oh, okay. That's how I see it. Like, I'll watch highlights and see, like, damn, that's three straight highlights. Hey, don't give them the sauce, man. Don't give them the sauce. No, but I mean, I mean they, they need to learn how to play, bro. I'm just saying. If, look, if y'all ain't going to pick me up, I might as well. You might as well. Like I said, if I go, I, I I'm need y'all to know how I'm coming. I'm not give them the sauce, dog. I'm also. Fuck. I'm Make with them the energy, it out. Bro. Right. I'm Tell with, them shit. I'm with the energy, bro. Like, for real, for real. If I can't use it, like, I want to use it right now. You see what I'm saying? Like, COVID hit. I had to get a surgery. Circumstances was fucked up. But it, this might help a nigga in the, in the playoffs right now. I you mean, just help the hood nigga figure out a fashion. This is amazing, story. motherfucker. Watch the tape, Nah, because this is a hood nigga who watching they be like, that's what I got to tell Real you. Real talk. <laughs> My circumstances like, fucked up Like, right there's now. so many games within the game, bro. Like, even the shit y'all were talking about, talking about calling the nigga musty and all that. Like, that's... Psychological. Bro, real talk. It's no. part of the game. You like, got to. Play me some pimping, man. I told you I knew it. I told you I knew, <laughs> I told you I knew the Nigga, game. Was you, in the, was you in the locker room that time when uh, when I came down there and I messed with uh, LeBron? Them? Was yeah, there, I was in there. Yeah, it was one nigga on the team got out the shower. I said, bro, what you get out the shower for? You ain't even play. I still smell the cologne on you, nigga. What's wrong bro, with you? The bed out of control. Ah, they keep my ass out. <laughs> Oh, this nigga trying to tell me they give everybody about six soaps. They got one for their feet, one for their hands, elite. one hey, for their oh, back. Listen, niggas be stankin'. You, you never so, been no athlete. Bro, now you on this too? Bro, athletes just I be naturally muscular. Even though I ain't play, I had to smell that shit. Oh, yeah, after, after 48 minutes of basketball, bro. Shit. Nah, fuck I'm niggas, sure, nigga. Niggas balls be like, yo. <laughs> nigga, practice got a whole nother bad. smell. You could just walk in there and be like, God damn, what the Listen, they don't even they don't even have they don't even sanitize the, the locker room. Tell the bitch she smell like basketball so practice. She, she gonna know like, exactly what you're talking we about. We talk about NBA facilities, bro. This is here. That don't mean shit. We be performing in this. They might not watch it for y'all. 
What the oh. fuck would they do some shit like that's that? That's bullshit. Oh. Y'all will just have a game and we'll come right in there. That's, and that's fucked up, man, how y'all treat Covenant saying, in the I'm NBA. I'm just saying, if it's steak in the marinas, bro. Hey. That was for y'all. I that ain't say it's steak. I just like said that. it that smelled like some stinking niggas had been in there. It sounds real racist because oh, if you, man, these yo, it days, smells too, like a nigga. These been days, in that here. NBA runway walk is that. I'm they, not so saying it stinks, but I smell. They overdoing it. You know, it's Afro like, sheen yeah, and stuff <laughs> like that. <laughs> Telling that though, that's all part of the sauce. Hey, bro. you smell the Afro sheen? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Smells like a nigga was in here. Man. <laughs> it's, it's a little while ago. It's a little while ago. <laughs> it wasn't. It, it wasn't long. <laughs> <laughs> they were here long, but they wasn't here long ago, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, retarded. <laughs> you hear this nigga, man? This nigga crazy as fuck, man. You better pay attention. <laughs> He'll slice your neck, man. You hear me? <laughs> hey, man, we got the exclusive chump mixtape in here, man. Man, let me folks know how long you been goddamn doing that music shit. They don't Bruh, even know we got Hold up, before you even take this nigga is living a great motherfucking life. This nigga hoop dreams came true. Yeah. This nigga got a gangster grills mixtape. Yeah. Bro, this nigga just go when you finish, nigga, you gonna go down as one of the greatest niggas <laughs> ever. What the fuck else? He ain't gonna, I'm telling you, bro. I just honestly, dog, as I as I think about it, bro, like sometimes, like even with you. Like when I listen to your music, yeah. the rapping shit, I ain't even used the singing shit. That's another yeah. whole nother. Yeah, you need to, hey, you dig what I'm saying? It's a whole nother <laughs> ball game. Right? Yes, sir. Bro, we you know drink hella Capri Suns. You going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, like, it's like I look at it and people fuck with the comedy shit because they like, they can see themselves in the regular. Him knowing what you knowing what's in the now, you right. knowing what 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 it was. You saying this is really how it is, and tapping into that with your fan base. It's yeah. like knowing that you have the skill of rapping. Why wouldn't I want to listen to you? I don't understand it. Like with me, I, I get people to come. Man, I just love how you how you you know what I'm saying how you be with your wife, your kids, man, and you do that hoop shit, man. You want to do your rap shit, man. That shit good, man. That shit dope. And it'd be like, but you listen to like a five foot character right. that ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like right. it's he, weird. He painted paint a, a persona. He ain't really, he ain't really talking yeah, about shit. Like he, he talked to his label before he turned it in. Right. And you listen to that. And I've always that disconnect is weird to me because it's like, how do you look up? I can't look up to it. Like I don't know. It's weird for me. I ain't trying to, I feel like I'm, I'm coming at- I'm, I'm with you. I wasn't like trying to come at the height of rappers or nothing like that. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, when I think of like, the appearance of somebody like, that I'm gonna have respect for, genuine respect for, with me being a 6'6 six, six dude, it's right. like, it's hard for me sometimes to rap the words of what some of the little niggas be talking about. You like, need to listen to Slim Thug, nigga. He's 6'6". Six, six. No, but that's what I'm saying. Thug on, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a understand. I'm going to relate. Because he going right. to talk about, like, what, what little rapper going to talk about what's on the top of the refrigerator? <laughs> <laughs> I, I never even thought about that. If a nigga 6'6", six, six, and all these rappers is 5'6", <laughs> and under black, <laughs> Hey, I don't want to hit his tough ass talk. Shut up, little. I feel you. What's on top of the refrigerator, bitch? No, nah, but it's, I, I only use that example because the other day I asked my I told, my wife asked me what what something was, and I told her it's on top of the fridge, and she was like, "Why would I look there?" Like, Damn. she came at me like, "Why would I look there?" You, so you just be why would you do around? that? Right. And I'm like, to me, to me, opening up the freezer, that's it right there. You there. Your but ass. I'm looking at it like, yeah, the scissors right here. You like, be looking on top of people for the right <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm saying that's what I see. Nigga, what be up there the most? Like, it's like this. Like, like we walk in, we walk <laughs> in somewhere, and, and say you got like a little laser tripwire or some shit. You got, you got something right there that's going, I'm not going to see it, bro. If I turn the corner, why would I see something down there? Right. You too I mean, high. I mean, I ain't going to trip. Like, metaphorical, what he's saying, he's, his vibration is too high for him to even focus what's low down. Fuck here. the metaphor. You dig what I'm saying? I, I, get what I'm saying though. I see what you're talking about. I'm like, I had to grasp it. I'm even, like, even certain shit, that's like going certain with. cars, like, okay. like you said, Thug gonna rap about being in a truck. I'm gonna be in a truck. 
You know what I'm saying? Like mm. some of these, they, they rap about a little lamp. I'm not gonna be in a Lamborghini. I can't fit. Right. I can't you rap. Tried I can't rap that. You tried. I definitely tried. I can't you rap. You got about right it. up out that bitch. You know what I'm saying? It sucks, but I can't. I want to hear niggas talk about big trucks, Joe. Right. I want to hear you talk about S550, super shit leg. That you can relate to. Maybachs and shit. Like I don't want to hear about stuff that I can't do. I want to hear about. Uh, uh, you can't listen to shit. Some dude. of the shit, but I'm, I'm saying on. I, I can't listen to nothing. You can't listen to shit. When I be around it, it just be like, but don't nobody really get down like that. Like right. I've heard people say, like I know it's just music. I just like it. I hear it should be sound. I'd be like, bro, but you listen to it all day. Like you singing it to me. It's annoying me, bro, because you don't even move like that. You singing that to me, and it's mm. weird. Like. Why are you listening to that? He gonna make you ruin your it's, life. It's not. So what you said. So, so You're a good kid, man. He gonna ruin your life. What are you talking about right now? You listen to enough of that, you gonna transform. That's the parent in you. Yeah. Yeah, but it be like, even my little cousins, I, bro, what? You for real? I just, you any of your little cousins? And I, I don't, and I can't, and I can't be like, no, don't listen to that. Like, I can't do that. You gonna do what you gonna do. You might dig into some whole more worse shit than that if I tell you. Can't. It has to relate, the music has to relate to your life. Yeah, I just, I just, I feel like that's what helped me. Like, people be thinking like, you gonna make it, you gonna make it to a level of what you, you know what I'm saying? Like, I listen to niggas that, Told me how to get it. Mm. Told me saying. stories how they My got it. My cousin let me hear his mixtape. Going crazy. I ain't even know the nigga talk. You ain't know what? But he talking about the some real shit. No idea. Oh, you don't know what he's talking about? You ain't even heard the shit. like the shit just like one long ass song. It just oh, yeah, one yeah. long ass song. But I'm saying some people make music <laughs> for, they make music for like a hit. I yeah. think that, I think that'd be a, you know what I'm saying? Or they make a sound that is like, this is a. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, it was like, he about said one, one long, long ass song. That was, it felt like, I was like, he did this shit by himself. Like, don't play nothing for nobody. I'm like, why are you making this secret shit? So it's just one long ass, eight minute oh, song. No, just, no, what he doing? He yeah. working on his shit, though. You tripping. It's, just a, it's an audio book. No, nah, he might be something one day. You he tripping. done gave him an audio book on the that, TV. Hey, hey, hey. That I ain't, I ain't like never knock it. I was just like. Oh, I, you said it like it was like every song sounded this That's why we asked him what shit, it sounded like. He, he did. Like, it just. Like a long ass loop, it just like that should have changed eventually. Then, like, <laughs> yeah, that yeah. shit sweet. This is nothing. Damn. So he ain't got. Oh, you you really saying like he did it himself? He placed the track back to back. <laughs> ain't nobody never heard this nigga rap nothing. So it's one track you can't even skip and go saying. to track. The fact two. that he doing it all on his own mean he gonna be something. I was doing the same yeah. shit, bro. He dedicated. So how you get started with the music shit? Ice Cube had a single. Uh, for a uh, fool, I'm a vet, you could bet that I could dance underwater and not get wet, mm -hmm. right? He dropped that drop, and I stole it out my brother's CD collection. And With it on top of the refrigerator? I played it, <laughs> and by as <laughs> us, oh, us, oh. You know I got that motherfucker <laughs> But <laughs> maybe I hit stealing from your brother. Uh, no, but I, yeah, I went in the CD collection and I grabbed it, and then um, I played it. And after the after the song, it gave you to edit it, and then it gave you the instrumental. Yeah. But I that, I didn't know that was on singles, but that was for like DJs to go crazy and shit. Then they gave you the acapella and you could put a different beat on it. And when I first discovered that I could get somebody else's beat and say what I wanted to say, mm. I was beat like, jacket. oh, it's lit. Like, mm -hmm. so I was just chasing niggas singles. Mm. And then when I couldn't get singles, I found out about like Wind Mix, LimeWire. I started bootlegging niggas shit. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm telling on myself. Well, everybody did, but. No, you had yeah, dreams. But, yeah, I, I feel Sounds bad. I done told that. plenty of these niggas when I met them in person, like, gee, I owe you some bread for real, for real. I owe you like dinner or something, because I made. <laughs> I was talking about, dog, I was mixing CDs for people. People wanted mix CDs. Oh, you need, what you need? You need the new DJ. You ain't tell me you was a DJ and all this old no, shit. No, so I'm learning how to DJ, but I was really like, I was an entrepreneur in high school. Like, people knew me in you high school. You was the mixtape nigga? I was the mixtape nigga, candy nigga. <laughs> Ooh. You was selling candy, oh, nigga. You selling. six six. You can't be out here selling candy, boy. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm told you. Listen, first of all, I was, all I was short. 
Hey, I was short. Dude, so, you, so you sold candy when you was a short nigga. That's where you ended your short nigga career. <laughs> you got on the team. He I'm couldn't saying, start selling candy no more. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Say I go to the store. Right. Everybody like, you going to the store? Yeah, I'm going to the store. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to grab a bunch of shit. Right. And then when I come back, you go send it. Two dollars, I give you this. Bro, everybody who come on here be telling how they was flipping shit. Bro, that's what I was on. Man, I was be. listen. My dad gave me thirty dollars. I was trying to show him I could turn it into something more. Right. I bought a, a, a mixing a burn disc burner. I bought the double disc burner, dog. I was like doing my homework and burning CDs the whole night. Easy. People would give me lists. It, people, girls would pass me notes. Miles was thinking I'm. Fucking with the girl. I ain't fucking with the girl. She gave me a note because this is her mix CD. She got a whole sex playlist. She got a new five dollars a CD. Brand new nigga. She wanna she want a sex playlist for him. She finna give a V card up. Bet I got you, mama. You see what I'm saying? That's I got awesome. these the five songs I want, but I want you to put the other thirteen. Put as many as you can for that eighty minutes on that on that CD. You know that's the, that's the yes sir. Shit. You know and I know what's going as on. As many as you can for that eighty minutes. Going crazy. Bet I got you. I'm giving a first verse or some shit. Editing the, the shit like they was like, damn, how you doing that shit? And then from from doing all that shit, bro, it was just like then I start throwing it in there like, yeah, I got my mixtape if you want to grab that. Cause now I got so many customers for CDs, they like you rap. I'm like, y'all rap. I'm gonna find one of your original mix CDs. Yeah, it's wild. Mm -hmm. I'm Dunk on the motherfucker. I, yeah, I know no. people. No, it's wild. Uh, somebody got one. Somebody got one. We gonna find one. We got if somebody it's gonna be got a fat bitch in Chicago, like I got all of them. <laughs> I used to fuck with him too. Y'all need to bring me. <laughs> it's, it's, we ain't gonna bring it. No, no, nah, nah, you gotta bring it. Pull it up though. I'm gonna I'm end up giving y'all a tape of. I, don't I need. Care. It. I, like I said, like it's all. It was part of what I had going on. So my eyes okay. understand what I be on. Like, well, if you know how I'm coming, you nothing will ever surprise you. I don't care what they paint to you in the media. Nothing. Once you see how I'm coming, you, you'll be like, I can't believe that, bro. I, I seen him. No, I, I've been around him. I ain't. Nah, he's solid, bro. You see what I'm saying? Like, that's how I wanted to feel. Like, especially with the music shit. I stopped trying to make the hits, bro. Just I'm not rap. finna, yeah, I'm not finna have the song in the club that's number one that's going. Cause I'm not finna talk about what everybody in the club be on. You right. see what I'm saying? I don't. I'm different. Yeah, I ain't, I, I ain't even on some different shit. I just don't do that no more. Right. I did that at one point where I was out and I wanted to, to, to go crazy and stun off and do dumb shit. I don't wanna do it no more. Right. I want to do some whole other shit. I'm in a whole nother pocket and I'm cool with that. Like, and I think that's why the music gonna come way better. Cause mine's gonna be like, all right, cool. I ain't, it ain't like a DJ gonna be forcing niggas to listen to right. me and shit. It's just like, if, if they we'll play it in the mix, yeah, if they play it in the mix, they're like, damn, that shit was smooth. What was that? Oh, that's Iman shit? Damn. Yeah. Like, I wanted yeah. to feel like that. Like, I don't, I want to see if niggas gonna really rap my words. I don't want them niggas to be like, oh, he the best NBA rapper I've ever heard. Oh, word, what's the best verse he did? And Miles just be like, I don't know. Nigga, you know that shit, the one where they had played it and then... And they gonna talk about the biggest <laughs> celebrity... Then they had the nigga, he came with the... Yeah, that, yeah. that one. Yeah, like, I don't want it to be that. I want yeah. it to be somebody could come up to you like, nah, like, spit a real verse. Like, right. And be like, nah, that shit was dope when you said that. Like, that's half my life. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn. Throw Riding titties around in with your rap. Mm -hmm. it's throw titties insane. in your rap. But that's what I did. I, started I rap on that. this show all the time, and every time I throw titties in that nigga, be like, nigga, <laughs> what a mixtape that. <laughs> that motherfucker you get back to Ariola's? <laughs> that make it better. People remember titties. Yeah. So look, think about it, right? You ain't got to do the whole song. Just throw a titty bar in there. <laughs> Your wife is a great artist. Yeah. Shout out OG West Hat and Tiana going yeah, crazy. Going now, for her to do music, yeah. and you do music, yeah. now, I know she supports your music. Yeah. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. So, how does that transition, you know what I'm saying? Like, even just being in one household, because now she a platinum artist. She got gold, you know, hits. Yeah. She doing her motherfucking thing. Really Grammys got one of the best shit. songs I, I, I love. You dig what I'm saying? So, how does it feel like having a, a platinum artist wife just being supportive to your music? Because, you know, this shit can be. It shouldn't get tough. It's uh, it's really dope, man. It, and honestly, I've been told her I was like, uh, I don't, you ain't gotta feature me on nothing. I don't, like, I don't want it to seem like a force. I'd rather have my fan base to where it's like, nigga, I'm already doing a House of Blues show, to where it's like it makes sense. Like, right. yeah, he bringing his wife out. But hell yeah. When we was uh doing the album. Cause you know what I'm saying? Like I sit in on the writing sessions and shit. My, my pen is always her pen if, I, you know what I'm saying? Like Dude. sometimes it'd be like, she be like, no, give him credit. Like he was in there helping me do the shit. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But I, I always felt like nigga, we- You ready, brother? 
Look, he going crazy. They go if they doing something, they nah, ain't knocking. Nah, you know we just gotta get down. Let know, cause everybody supposed to be in here. Man, nigga, you gonna have me on tilt. Oh. You gonna oh, have me do. on tilt, oh, no, nigga. I'm finna unzip. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. Hell, buddy, fuck. Oh, gee. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, man, fuck the cameras. I'm finna. <laughs> This is not safe, man. Fuck the camera. You good, you good. You just, you know, everybody's gonna be here. I ain't know we had cut. No, that's cool. <laughs> but I'm like, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, we got cut. But that's why I'm ta- that's what I'm talking about swimming, man. Everybody ain't swimming, everybody can't swim. Like, nigga, knock at the door and everybody reach. We all reach. You did what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, yes, all right, man. We all gonna reach for something in this motherfucker <laughs> here. Fuck it. Somebody got a point. Damn, yeah, I got it. Is the world 70% water? I am the spotter. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot that way. <laughs> man. Get the man out of here. <laughs> get that guy out of here. <laughs> no, but like I like I was saying, before I get before I forget. Yeah. Like, she she wanted, like, while we was in that writing session, she really wanted me to try and come up with something for her to rap. Mm-hmm. And then when I like gave her the cadence and shit. I really was my, you know what I'm saying? It was late, so my voice was all raspy. And shit. Mm-hmm. So she like, no, hey, just, just why don't you just try and write something and just do it in that voice? I go to write, and then they came back with the words that wake up, love. So mm-hmm. I'm like, oh, okay, that's why when I when I delivered it, I was supposed to like, I wanted to drink water and all that. Like that shit was one take. Tiana was like, yes, perfect. Like leave it like that. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, damn, G, like, I don't need, I ain't get to clear my, like, you know what I'm right, saying? My right. shit, it really sound like I really exactly woke up. Exactly what you, you exactly, trying to Exactly, like, because she already saw, like, her artistry is more like, I see it. Mm-hmm. And once she see it, that's it's it. Rap. That's it. It's she rap. like, they ain't got to see it. They'll see it when I do the video. They'll right. see it. But she more so made me tap into, people got to see you do it. Like, Hannah Kane always be telling me that, like, nah, we gotta see you do it, see you walk it, like, we gotta see you deliver it, like, we gotta see how you see it in your head, all that, cause that, that's the only way we can rate you as an artist. We can't really go off of, oh, here, click on this link, click on this link, click mm-hmm. on this link, like, so Tiana's more so like, you got a video in your mind, she's like, oh yeah, I can see it, like, she listens to the song and she be like, oh, that shit sound like you just, on the desert, like, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. With the brown cloak on, and, and, and for some reason you shirtless. I don't know why you shirtless. <laughs> we'll, we'll, fi- we'll figure out why you shirtless. <laughs> There's um, a reason behind that. You see what I'm saying? But she just- She's visionary, she can see it. And it's like being around that excitement and that energy, it, it, it's natural for me to drop my guard up. Oh, I ain't gonna go that hard because then everybody gonna think I ain't focused. It was yeah. like, like little by little being with her. It was, it was damn near like freeing me, like, gee, Nigga, okay, cool. You shut up and you acted like you didn't rap for I don't know how long. Did right. you get the Sprite deal? No, kick rocks. Like, right. you know what I'm going. saying? Like, what I'm what I'm doing? That I ain't doing nothing but getting older. What I'm what I'm acting like I don't like rapping for? Cause right. y'all don't like it. It ain't cool, bro. Don't put me on your commercial. That's cool. Like, I ain't tripping. Like, let me. I'ma still build my brand to the point where nigga, y'all asking to be on the commercial. Mm. You see what I'm saying? Cause if the album do good. Now you same brand is gonna be like, oh well, he hot on this right. on this end. Like I don't know, they, they wasn't well, giving. We always believed in you. That's what how you, it goes. What you talking about? But it's like it it got to the point where that fear of it, like Tiana, gonna cross lines. Like she not with the whole. Like you got, I gotta remind her if we gonna have to. Oh, oh, you know what I'm saying? The cameras on and shit. Right. Like it's just like, bro, this is what it is. Like. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're gonna have to start desensitizing people to it. It's like, gee, y'all could hit a, like you said, you could hit a microphone when somebody do something. I'm, hey, Joe, stop that shit. Hey, I, I, cut that shit out, Joe. I don't wanna hear it. I get my eyes tweeting me all the time. Bro, did you just say cut that shit out, Joe? Oh, my soul, you wildin'. <laughs> Everybody from Chicago, hey, Joe, hell no, you ain't never get on his ass, shorty. <laughs> Hashtag West Side shit. Fuck like, you, mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, I see that shit because it's like, Joe, y'all hear that amplified microphone? We playing a game, and that's part of the game, bro. Right. Like, what I'm gonna do? Go now, I do an appearance, and I just don't curse. Right. I have no curse words, nothing. It's like, gee, it's the most ingenuine experience. Like, why would you want to meet Robot Iman? Mm. You don't want to meet me like that, bro? Give me a hug. You want it? You want niggas want that? You right. know what I'm saying? Like, right. damn, I knew he was. I knew he. I knew it. Yeah. This nigga here getting chicken. Dude. Oh! That's how people be though. Exactly. They see me. They be like, you ain't never in the chicken spot. You by yourself. Right. You by yourself. 
Boy, you know, y'all don't need bodyguards. Little Tiana be out. Y'all just be outside like this. <laughs> Real nigga. Right. Like, I get that. And it's like, gee, I'd much rather that than the awkward. This shit. Out of nowhere, and they, they got their phones out of nowhere. Yeah. 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 That's it. That's how it happened. Put the whole they forget the light that told on them. Don't tell them how they be looking, bro. Oh, they hit you with this one. And then they act like they not looking at you. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Nigga, your eyes ain't move. I see you looking dead at me. Just say something, bro. I'm not weird. I'm not a I'm not like that. Hey, what's up, man? It's man Carlos Mill over here at the 85 South Show. Something nice. I am trapped in the studio and I don't know how I'm gonna get something to eat. You know what I do? Pick up the phone and open the DoorDash app. Yeah, they bring you everything, man. DoorDash has something for every lifestyle. On the go with no time to waste, order pickup and pass the line. Delivery is more than just pizza in 2020. With a selection of your favorite flavors from across the globe, you can order world cuisine from the comfort of your living room with DoorDash. So make sure you download the app and use promo code 85 South so you can get $5 off your first order of $15 or more. That's promo code 85 South. You've got big plans for 2020, but when will you find time to do it all? Order delivery with DoorDash and take back time in your day. We use it. We want you to use it. That's why we're giving you the promo code. And for the people who don't know what a promo code is, it's kind of like a coupon before the internet. So if you go in there and they say enter the promo code, always enter 85 South so you can get the best deal possible. With door-to-door -door delivery in all 50 states, Puerto Rico, Canada, and Australia, you can order from your local go-tos or choose from your favorite national restaurants like Chipotle, Wendy's, Chick-fil-A, and the Cheesecake Factory. Get the app. Go to the app store and get the app. You don't have it yet? Why we still talk? I got food on the way. What were you saying, bro? Go to commercial. Like y'all ever see me out, Joe? You see me eating? I ain't shit, bro. I ain't, I'm not out here living like that where I'm just like, don't talk to me, don't. Like, if you want to come by, be, hey, man, respect, whatever, Joe. Solid, what up? Man, I ain't even like that, where I be, like, walking around stiff-arming people. I don't want to live like that. Right, I told right. you, like, I like energies, bro. Like, being in this room, everybody <laughs> just chilling, like, in the vibe. Like, that's my shit, bro. Like, you see me go home, my family, no. We having a kick it. Everybody come to one house. They be like, man, you always want to do this. We should just do something so we can have more seats. I, before I sit on the floor, I do not care. Right. I need the room to be small. I need it to be hot. You're going to have to cut the AC on. I want to, everybody to be drunk. My aunties, I want y'all to wild out, bro. Right. <laughs> Let me know I'm still a human, bro. I'm not a robot. I be having right. to tell my family, other family members that don't come over to the house as much, I be having to tell them, bro, like, I, I understand I'm in the league. Like, I understand that's my teammate. That's I my job. I understand, but I'm still him. You know what I'm saying? I'm still him. Don't, don't make me feel weird. Like, I just want to be him forever, bro. I don't, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, if I, well, I make it to the league to become, I ain't trying to transform into that. I ain't, right. Maybe I'm not a league nigga. Maybe right. I'm not that. I'm not that, maybe. I don't know. I made it to the league, bro. Right. We just got to change the narrative. <laughs> That's all. It's still I real niggas it. out here. Like, I just, you know, niggas I don't know. The league, man. I don't know no other way. Like, maybe I'm just, maybe I'm like, real talk, my homie told me that. Nigga, he was like, what if you just a rapper that made it to the league, bro? What if we just got it wrong? And I was like, damn, G, sometimes I be wanting to say that. But if I say that, bro, that's a hell of a mistake to make. I tell you that much, nigga. You but want both ways. But it's like, G, real talk, I was short. I was five six. And you got five, a growth eight in high school. Nowhere. Yeah, but I, this is what I was doing. I'm rapping. I'm in spoken word club. Like I'm on the slam team. I'm nice. Like yeah. I'm rapping. I'm after we hoop. I'm we on the blocks rapping. Mines is dissing each other. We get into a couple of fights. Like that's what I was doing. And I went to sleep that summer, sophomore year. I woke up and I was six three, bro. God damn. Man, where the fuck you go to sleep oh, at? No, <laughs> no bullshit. Like, like, who house was you? I ain't gonna lie, I need to lay in that exact bed. You, Chris, you still slept at that summer. Like, you my at least 5'11", nigga. We was, definitely need to my go. My knees was hurting, my elbows was hurting. Like, my back, it seemed like I was never comfortable in Did the bed. Did you get a like, radioactive spider, nigga? He turned into the Incredible Hulk over the summer, <laughs> yeah, we, Me and my <laughs> brother still. <laughs> <laughs> 
me and my brother <laughs> had the bunk beds at the crib, so we had to take the bunk beds off. Then my dad had to take the front panel off God the bunk bed so my feet could hang off the what you call. Your head drunk the juice off Space Jam. <laughs> For real, <laughs> touch the ball. This the special juice. <laughs> That shit was mad as fuck cutting that bed but up. That shit. <laughs> you fuck keep growing. Nigga, you get the blood before test. Ain't no goddamn way. Before I went on my AAU circuit and I, I killed niggas, bro. Real ooh, I killed niggas. But I, I came on the AAU circuit, I was not, I was not ranked. And then I killed everybody and I came back and I was 15th in the country. Mm. So everybody was just like, he going to the league. Then it was like my rapping, like you go back, you can look at them old McDonald's All-American footage. I'm rapping there. I got my mm. Buck 50 hat with the watch on it. Like, I was super like, nigga, I'm from Chicago, where y'all from? What y'all do over there? Yeah. Yeah, what y'all be on? Like, and Mars was looking at me like, I mean, you don't get free shoes from Nike? I'm like, what? Free shoes from Nike? What are you talking about? <laughs> what do you mean? Y'all get free shoes? What y'all get? You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, what y'all? Like, they had a whole different, they've been that good. They've been ranked since sixth grade. Right. Niggas it's walking, time. They walk in the gym. Well, I came in the gym in a hoodie. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Some wars, some white crew socks. Look like you was running to the store. Type shit. Take my book bag off and get busy and Going buck quick. on there. Yeah, I'm talking to people crazy and they like, who is this? Like, where are you? You know what I'm saying? Then they rank me. I'm getting offers from everywhere. You know, mama crying, dad crying. Like, I'm. It was like overnight shit. I'm right. like, damn, bro. I just was like thinking, like, damn, am I going to ever get close to the league? Man, I just woke up tall. It was weird as fuck. So if you a kid, man, <laughs> you read sugar in your shoes, all that bullshit, bro, just keep on really thinking hard about being. All I told myself, I want to be 6'6", six, six, like Jordan. I want to be 6'6". Six, six. If I was 6'6", six, six, I'm telling you, Dad, I'll be dunking that. I'm throwing the ball up. It's five 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 five. Now. We just been I know, man. Asking for the wrong shit. Real talk, but that. The That's energies crazy. work like that, bro. Nigga, that like real talk, you'll think it don't energies work like that, bro. You some people ask you, you be surprised at what your kid what when you was a kid, what you tell yourself you was gonna be doing? This shit right here. You did? Yeah, I think I always knew I was be a comedian. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, you for real? I'm dead to fuck serious. No, nah, you know, you funny yeah, he funny the motherfucker. You know, but I've been a comedian since I was like four years old. You for real? I'm you dead to fuck serious. That, bro. No, the first time talking. I ever made everybody in a big ass room laugh, I was at church and I forgot dead. my Easter speech and they walked me all the way from the back of the church and they was like, yeah, we're doing our Easter program. And I got the microphone Basically. and I was like, damn. I forgot my damn Easter speech. <laughs> Mom, I forgot my damn Easter speech. And I stood there. She had to come all the way from the back of the church. So the whole time she coming up there, I'm like, damn, damn, what's that damn speech? <laughs> I know the damn speech, but I can't think of the damn speech. <laughs> man, got my ass whooped right in front of the church, man. She was, I'm talking about everybody in the church falling out laughing. <laughs> Bro, oh, I get great. my bro we had to go home. Like, ain't no going back in there. We went from the church. Ass whooping crib. <laughs> yeah. But the, when I went back, I was a legend. They were like, let him say something. Find that boy something to do. Right. The Lord moves through him. <laughs> That's real though. What? Everybody had a better Sunday after that, Man. right? Here. That's real though. That's but it's crazy. like like him just doing that, like saying, I like that. Like telling yourself as a kid, I like that. I love that. I'ma do that. Like I'm so happy. That's what make I feel like. That's what make me the man I am. Like saying, I said I was gonna do it, and I'm doing it. Like, right. I told myself I'm rapping. Like you gonna rap. You know what I'm saying? If a nigga diss you, you gonna diss him back. Right. You know what I'm saying? If if it go down, it go down. If you you know what I'm saying? I told myself these things, and then I got to some of these lines, and I'm like, oh, I gotta get my contract first. Don't drop that. But I'm like, I should have dropped that, bro. Because I just basically told myself, you ain't good enough to do that, and they still want you. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, that's what Damian Lillard is proving right. to me. Going crazy, right? Nice, too. He like, I'm going to drop 60 to where, so what if I rap? I'm clearly doing something right. 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 You get what I'm saying? Like, and I wish I was more tapped into that. Like, I didn't, but like I said, when my career didn't go to where it's like, you get 20 shots a game, you the main guy. Like, I settled into playing the role because I'm like, gee, I could get a ring with Melo. Mm -hmm. I can get a ring with Bron. Like, that's what I was thinking. I'm like, gee, I get to play with Jason Kidd, Rasheed Wallace. Right. Fuck Legend. it. If I don't right. shoot, fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck Rasheed it. Rasheed is my teammate, bro. Like, <laughs> that bro, I was kicking it with Rasheed Wallace. Picture Rasheed Wallace picking you up, bro. Lit with the patch. 
But it's just like, it was, you know what I'm saying? Like, these is my heroes. Like, Jason Kidd, my favorite player, bro. Like, it was like, J Kidd, like, hey, Rook, I need you to go grab. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I tore my ACL, so I was like a rookie until the, I had finished my 82. So even when my second year in the league, when I had him as a vet, it was like, but it was like just for him to jokingly say it. They really didn't have me do a lot. Having Tyson Chandler, Jason Kidd, like, nigga, I remember being in, in Chicago up in the stands screaming, Tyson Chandler going crazy. Cool. I'm, I'm screaming top of my lungs, bro. Like, and then I'm playing next to you niggas. Like, I don't mind if I don't shoot a couple times. You paid your dues, cool. Part of me wanted to do the asshole shit where I'm like, no, fuck this, give me my shots. But I feel like it went better because I got a ring, bro, and I got to learn, I got to know the game. Like, even if they politically don't give me my 30 shots, if we have a one-on-one -on -one tournament one day, y'all gonna see it. Tango, bust niggas ass. Nigga gonna niggas be like, why you ain't do that in the game? If you watch the game, instead of looking at the box score, you'll see I didn't touch it. The mm -hmm. three, the three threes that it say I went 0 for 3 for, two of them was half court heaves at the end of the shot, uh, at <laughs> the end of the game, at the end of the quarter, and one of them was a, a shot clock, damn near a violation, but I got it off because I'm. Seeing if I could put it on the rim to see if Tristan Thompson could tip it back in. Like, right. I know I ain't got a shot at this, but get it to the rim. Like some niggas would be like, man, I ain't doing that. Mess up my percentage. I could have been that guy. I'm smart enough. Like, yeah. I could have told myself, yeah, just make sure your percentage high, and then you can ask for more money, whatever. But nah, bro, bump play that. Joe, play yeah. Role. What if I shoot that 75 footer and go in, and we win the game by three, bro? I'm shooting that shit. Fuck that. Like, okay, y'all gonna laugh. Cool. Y'all not champion. That shit uh, mean a lot. At the end of the day, they're not that fucking is. champions. That like, is. That's gonna close the envelope. Yeah. Yeah. It I mean, y'all gonna laugh, but y'all ain't champions. Real talk. Like, it sucks sometimes, though, because my eyes will talk they shit, and you be wanting to tell niggas, like, bro, if, I, if the coach let me shoot 25 of these a game, I'm telling you, and I'm a different ball game, too. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I know you're used to that superstar, but if I was a superstar, hey, I'll run my kingdom a little bit different. You see what I'm saying? Mm. They got all these kings. Or, like, that's what I look at this shit. The NBA is a game of thrones to me, for real. Like, right. when Bleacher Report was doing that, 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 that episode shit about mm -hmm. that shit, that shit was so cold, because that's how it really feel to me. Like, Motherfucker all just trying to get to that iron throne or whatever, but having like all these different guys that's supposed to be superstars of each mm -hmm. team and seeing how they run their kingdom, how you mm -hmm. run your ball club. But you was like, over there for a reason. For sure. <laughs> niggas know you gonna need a nigga like me. For real. <laughs> You're gonna need a guy, let me say a guy like me so y'all can use the clip. Right. You're gonna need we a gonna guy. Use like it anyway. No, that. <laughs> no, I'm saying, but you know, if they put it on Shade Room, they're gonna bleep out the nigga. I don't want mm -hmm. you to have bleep outs. I want y'all to have an official, official mover. You're gonna need a guy like me though. So why not? So why not? Go, <laughs> so why not go to a, to another team and just just take over? Just like you know what? Train me to a team that really need, you know what I'm saying? Some fundamental. Just they need help. They would have had. I would have had to do that when I was 22. Hmm. Cause it's like I'm 30 now, and I've I've yet to have a team where I get to shoot 30 times. God damn. Ever? Huh? In the league or just period? In the league. Oh okay. no 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 no. You can go to college. It's, you're talking about 30 a game. Like, yeah. at least I'm, talking about, I'm talking about whether I'm shooting it good or I'm shooting it bad. You still get 30 shots. I'm shooting 25, 30 shots. Okay. Like, fuck a Give me your opportunity. Fuck to a get free throw. Shit. I'm shooting 25 of these, bro. What do you mean? It's going up at least 25 times. So even game. when you had the ball sometimes, you was just like, ah, you it's on you. him. Right. But that's what I'm saying. <clears throat> a part of me, a part of me was doing that. A part of me was like, I'm not in rhythm, mm. you know what I'm saying? Sometimes I'll make the, the extra pass because in my head, JR just shot four times. He made two of them. If he hit this, the rim's huge. You know what I'm saying? I'm already knowing me and you only finna get, we finna share like 10 shots in this shit because we got Bron and Kai and Kev, so okay. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, if we only finna get five of these, which means I'm probably gonna get this one shot and I ain't shot the ball all game. JR, you done shot four of these. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Knock this fifth one down and the crowd goes crazy. Me, if I hit one, they go, like, okay, cool. Okay, you want hit one? But you already got the energies. That's part of the game. Mm -hmm. Some niggas be wanting me, yeah, you shoot that shump. I ain't shot the ball all game. <laughs> Boom, he dumb. Look, he dumb. He think, <laughs> he think he got influence. Boy, don't you know you a lame? <laughs> you a lame, bro. <laughs> You a lame. I don't care how much you score, we gonna win by 20. 
You a lame. You a lame. You know what I'm saying? Like that's, that's cool. The shit you be saying to get I say that to niggas. Bro, I niggas say that to the niggas at the free throw line. There's niggas head. that score you 30 a lame. and think they cool after the game. Bro, either you cool or you not. Right. You cool or you not. If you score 30, you can score 30 and walk into the I don't watch a million women walk past 30 points. You gonna give me some money? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, uh, like who no. is he? Who is no, women see it too. Like, no, I like how he get down. He, he ain't going for that shit. Like, I like how he get down. Like, at least, exactly. the, at least the women I'm looking at. Exactly. That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, everybody, everybody who knows anything. My wolf, she know don't be the like, 12th you man need. on the team is the nigga with what? the hoes. He, <laughs> he ain't touched the floor since Oklahoma. That's how it goes. Crazy. But he done had bitches in 23 cities. <laughs> the cold ones. And then you, Twelve of them. you the nigga hitting Bye. 30 over and over again. They keep walking past you, you the, the buddy that don't get in the game. All oh, you get to talk to is sports center but it's and like, go to the room. People want to feel, bro. Right. Want to feel the energy. It. I know a million, uh, a million comedians, Joe. Every time I walk past this nigga, I'm going to have to laugh. You know what I'm saying? Every time I'm going to giggle before you even do some shit. Like, that's how Kevin Hart is to me. Like, hey, before you even say something, Joe, I walk up on you. I don't know what you going to say, so I'm already in a giggly. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Real talk. Nigga, if, this nigga, 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 if this nigga got a microphone, if he got a microphone, I'm already like, nigga, don't even look over here, nigga, don't even. Don't even look over here, Joe. I don't even want you to put me in a joke, Joe. Don't even, Amen. I ain't gonna be able to breathe and defend myself. Amen. No, no, leave me alone, bro. Like, this is the funniest it's natural the energy. nigga you will ever see. He ain't gotta even say shit to make it's me the laugh. Energy. I can see this nigga and he don't even know I see him. It's just the way that nigga gonna have his shirt tucked in with this big ass belt buckle. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga might have $500 in, in stripper one. <laughs> Going crazy. Go to the club, throw two of them bitches, leave with 498. Fuck that game, we straight. Like, this the funniest, <laughs> this the funniest nigga, bro. <laughs> you don't give no fuck. I seen this nigga not pay a motherfucker and win all the money at the dice game. Won't even get a nigga at $40 back. Made the nigga wait the longest for the game. That's just the type of nigga he is, though, man. It's just one of the niggas that just make me laugh doing ghetto shit. <laughs> 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 shit. Nigga doing ghetto shit. That nigga that on, the yeah, have on some thousand dollar shoes. Kick them bitches off. That nigga sock me this goddamn long. <laughs> <laughs> like, that nigga just don't give a fuck, man. Hey, you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. he talking about this nigga. Nah, he's talking about like, you. Oh, nigga. Nigga. I'm just like, this nigga. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. yeah. He's sitting there like, this sound like me right yeah. here. Yeah, I'm like, look at that. That's a million. That being around this nigga, <laughs> man. Look at that muscle. I see this nigga kick, nigga sock me long. I'm like, like, why you got that muscle? I'm long. like, nigga, you a real nigga. <laughs> no, I don't. No, my socks usually match. Yeah, nah, mine don't. They he don't give no fuck, going bro. On, man. Like, ain't nobody see my feet. Right nigga, now, I ain't got on no socks. This is what I'm saying. That you can get this. This wherever this nigga at, man. That's he gonna be himself. He don't give no fuck, fuck that's bro. That's the best shit in the world, Joe. But, but you know what? You the first that. NBA player I ever. I want to say you was probably my first NBA friend. Yeah. And then not only that, he was like, bro, I fuck with your music. And not only that, you were like, fuck that. I'm finna drop a meat tape. And I'm like, nigga, I got to be on that. I ain't <laughs> never, nigga. This is like Shaq and the Fool. Nigga, mm -hmm. I ain't never been on no NBA nigga meat tape. Real I was like, what? We finna rock. What's and the one y'all did? Shit, I mean, what long ago that been? That been about five years. What we call it? I forgot, but we, we, the nigga, I knew it was crazy because we were going around the NBA circuit. A lot of NBA players were like, hey, boy. That shit that goddamn track. You did with Iman Nick. I'm like, oh, y'all niggas listen to each other. Everybody was called music. on guard, yeah. but I was like, gee, when the nigga played his shit, and then he put it on World Star, I'm like, bro, we gonna act like this just went over everybody. Like, that ain't, it ain't nobody tapped in. It was just weird to me. I'm like, it's weird. I, I think it's just people saying, this person do that. And since I couldn't even do that, right. I ain't finna check into the other shit that motherfucker doing. You know what I'm saying? Like, but it was like I was saying, if you <laughs> fuck with that man and he do music, he probably gonna tell you a little something about himself. Now, right. if I go click on your page and you just wasn't talking about shit, right? I've been like, all right, he rapped. And I feel like my mistake early on was I was trying to make hits, so I did that. Right. But it's like I made music that it was like I'm trying to be something for the fans instead of just being you. Yeah, I'm like, gee, real talk, I never wanted to do this, but my first video that I tried to put together, they was like, no. Right. <laughs> like, so, no, <laughs> you can't come like that. No, no, no. Got to be Yeah, but I was just like, bro, this is the world. This is how I got here. 
<clears throat> like without this world that I rap about, I wouldn't be right here. I'm not here, bro. I'm like, you wouldn't even like how I play basketball. I probably would play it soft as fuck. I probably would want to run around and shoot threes. I would never want y'all to remember me as a, a three-point shooter specialist. Yeah. I would never want y'all to remember me like that, bro. No, I don't want to be him. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's like, I don't even, at, like, at 30, it makes so much sense. And at 22, it was such a, you know what I'm saying? I was trying to please so many so different many people. people, so many different brands that I'm just like, oh, hey, man. It was crazy, but it's like, gee, was it worth it? Because... Like y'all still didn't give me the eighty million dollar Sprite deal or something that I was. You know what I'm saying? Niggas told me like, man, you so personable, man. You can't have no shit cursing. You can't be cursing on your raps. You can't be doing. You can't. And I'm like, that was the reason. Nigga, I curse now and I do how I move, how I move. And my daughter, (coughs) she's smart as hell. Like, don't curse. Know how to edit. She could listen to my whole verse, learn the verse, and edit out the curse words on her own. Like, right. I ain't got to play her edited music and lie to her about weird shit. Yeah, she probably understands how to curse. Cool. What I want her to do? Lie about it and act like she don't know what's going on, but then go to school and curse up a storm. Now I get all a call. kids curse. I'm going to get a call from the teacher, and I'm going to act all they weird all and get mad at her. Like, I wasn't cursing <laughs> when I was in sixth grade. i tell you what oh, shocked man. you about your kids I was, cursing. I made it okay. I'm right. okay. Right. Only thing shocking I about think? finding out <laughs> that your kids curse is hearing them curse and use the shit right. Yeah, and saying it just like they the say that they use the curse words in the right context. It'd be impressive. Yeah. Curse like, better than let me get my goddamn ass up and clean this fucking room up before they come in here bitching at me and shit. <laughs> like, whoa, whoa, mm-hmm. when you start talking like that, <laughs> but that's exactly what's gonna happen. You clean this motherfucking room up. <laughs> Matter of fact, come here. Fuck around with it. I'm telling you, man. I'm walking past my son's room. He playing the goddamn Fortnite. He on the earphone, he don't know, I hear him. He got the door open. <laughs> this bitch killed me again. <laughs> My team ain't worth a fuck. <laughs> Damn. Oh, that Man, you just a dickhead. You saw my, you just gon' I was like, son, turn that off. You too emotional. <laughs> I'd have let him live. Go ahead, son. You locked in no, right now. Lord, keep you going, locked nigga. in, son. Let me talk to him. Fuck you. Ass, bitch. Add to it. Wake your dad up, bitch. <laughs> We're gonna too jump much, you, ho. <laughs> too much of a good father. I was like, ain't nobody fucking with you, is it? <laughs> Fuck you, mean? But you know what to pick back up on your shit, right? I know why people, like how you said it, like, motherfucker went over their head. Because the average person is below average. The average person is definitely below average, but they one track minded. Mm-hmm. So they wake up and robotically, and you know, people listen to music is systematically robotic. You know what I'm saying? They like robot. They, they they feel like you do basketball, that's it. You can't do nothing else. I done put you in the box, boom. Even if you want to do something else, they like, what are you doing? You supposed to be playing basketball. My guy, my brain works at an all time high, my nigga. I'm not a one track minor. I'm here, there, there. I can be there. You just make <coughs> you can't be here, there, yeah. there. But guess what? The people who can be here, there, there, and there, understand what the fuck I'm doing. Real talk. Yeah. So I understand. So we get so trapped in trying to plead the one trap mind. Fuck them niggas. I'm so done. I'm doing the Tiana Taylor shit where I'm showing. That's why the 24 hours did 7 million views and up 27 million streams. Cause uh. now we got 27 million people who, who does here, there, and there, and they recognize it. So. I just want you to stay down and stay consistent because I seen it from back then. Real when you told me you did music, I went and checked it out. I said, man, this nigga just don't rap. He rap. Right. I'm hearing the cadences, the flow. I got to get with this. I got I to I gotta, I gotta, I gotta tap in because they don't tell you what type of energy we can create. You feel what I'm saying? Right. So yeah, just for so. you to be on that, that, that platform, and I was still on the uprise, and I'm like, damn, I got an NBA superstar listening to my shit. Man. Nigga. Real life. <laughs> Tap that's in. what I'm saying. Real energy is like when you say something that's just, it's like, gee, I, like I would say that. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could hear, I could hear a verse. Three niggas can have a verse on a song, and it's like, okay, this man verse the best. I know the club gonna love what he said. It right. was some bird shit, but 
this nigga first. Like, gee, I'll pick this man up on a day to day. Like, hey, bro, you got yours? I got mine. We all. Go. <laughs> What right you in. mean? What you mean? Like, hey, G, come on, man, hurry up. Yeah, I got half on it. Come on. <laughs> Let's mean? go, man. You got something? You got snaps on the Petro? Okay, we saying? good. <laughs> we good. But I, I make sure I pick this man up because he get down like me. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, that would be my that be my day-to-day -day homie where a girl be like, oh, man, like, you ain't got no friend. Um, I got my friend over here. Cool, this my man. He, yeah, that's my man. Right. He ain't going to say nothing goofy. I can leave the room. He ain't going to say nothing goofy that ain't player. He right. ain't going to say that. He going to make us look good. Right. Cool, you that's my guy. Saying. You right. know what I'm saying? Like, right. you always going to have that verse. You got to have those. You going to have that verse that you say that once I feel like that, now I could be a fan of your music. You know what I'm saying? I could check for your music. Like, I'll never forget, uh, Dirt came out with, this ain't what you want. Right. And first thing I said was, I feel like out of all the 300 guys, I'm like, I feel like he got the biggest trampoline to go off because he mm -hmm. already understand how to make a song that's structured for the radio and Always. still get his shit off. Right, like, right, right. But he'll damn near sing it with that auto tune to where it don't sound like he rapping your ear off, even though he used to rap your, you know right. what I'm saying? Like, that, but that's, rap, a, rap. that's how we, you know what I'm saying? Heard him first, but we was like, it was cool to see he also has this side. And then he tapped into this, a whole new wave of it. So when I, when I listen to Dirk now, when Granny Crib dropped, I was like, gee, I'm gonna forever be a fan. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Just just that, I had roaches at my granny crib. Yeah, ooh. Jumped into the streets on accident. Yeah, yeah. Police snatched me up, they better not ask me shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just like regular shit. Talk like shit. Being, you know what I'm saying? It's like, gee, I was, we all was at some point all at our grandmama house where, yeah, a couple of us, you gonna stay, you know, yeah, she stayed with my grandma for a little bit and then this person stayed for a little bit. You might stay there a week. You know what I'm saying? Everybody did that in the summer. But June. all your cousins, everybody was there. You got your friends, they friends. You know what I'm saying? Now y'all come. Every once in a while, you get in a car that you should not be in. Mm -hmm. You going to see some shit you should not be on. It's like, I didn't want to do this. Right. But mm -hmm. now I'm used to this. Because mm -hmm. this really my method. man. Right. Like, it's like you was this scary nigga. Like, damn, this nigga on the Let's walk the other way. But then you know my brother. Now you look at me like, oh, that's like my little homie. Ain't nobody messing with my little homie. So now it's like, if you want to ride to the store, yeah, you might be riding illegal as hell. But to you, it's just normal. I'm not finna have you walking by yourself. You a kid still. So boom, you were, and it just, it got to the point where it's like, damn. So if I go do some like basketball shit, am I supposed to act like I don't know them? Mm. Cause when we look at the crowd, I can see them. I can't see a lot of people. I can see a lot of friends that it's like, we friends, but I, during a game, I would never be able to remember you at the game. Right. I'm looking, I'm searching for my dog. Where you at? Right. I'm searching to win. Cause when they it seen went you down. in them car rides. That right, right there mm -hmm. reminds you of where you came from. And, and you get right. to really see where you done made it to when you see that same, you know, element dog, present and where you done progressed to. If the NBA ever let it be that standard, like you remember the high school games, the standard room only games? Mm -hmm. If the NBA ever let it be standing room only again, how it used to be, G, be and crazy. I get to do a dunk and a crowd of people is right there, I'm gonna be a totally different ball player. And really, the refs gonna have to let me get away with it because they're gonna be like, damn, like we can't lose that. The fans love that. When he does that, Hulks. you could tell he made that shit. He was like, "Nigga, stay up and nigga, motherfucker." Real life talk. With the That's nigga my whole game, up. though. Like, you know what that's you, me know? when you talking like, "Nigga, I swear to God, I mother boy." Chico, then he opened his mouth. Yeah. He already yeah. been practicing the dunk, but it's like it's, it's like that energy of like people being like, "I told you, like having these guys over here." I know the niggas that's betting on the game. I know. I know. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, not the, not the real bets, yeah, yeah, yeah. not don't, the Vegas know. bets. No, no, I, that's what I'm saying. Not the Vegas bets and shit. He don't know. I don't do spreads, my nigga. I'm trying to be gold. I'm trying to do gold championships, bro. You ain't going to shave no points getting that gold. He know the niggas do work. But four to six that I like. You don't know. I'm talking about, I'm talking about your guys that since, since you was playing in the park. Your friends. Yeah, they'll tell this random homie, oh, that's it. He ain't the best player around here. Iman the best player around here. They be, boy, no, he not. Cool. Put 100 bands on your man. Right. Let's go. Damn. Street niggas. Let's like, go. Wait, wait, wait. Shit. 
It was like 40 to 60. Yeah. 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 It just had I'm a hundred rubber bands wrapped around. You know how street yeah, niggas rubber bands. It's not a rubber band. Legally. I'm saying, I'm saying, Everybody grew up with this. It wasn't illegal back then because ain't nobody think I was gonna be shit. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Like, oh, and I ain't saying it was really a hundred bands. Hold up, you talking about when you wasn't shit? Nigga, say whatever you want to say. I'm, I'm throwing a crazy like number today, out there just like to say, you like, know they got investigation. I but you were, you, you know, now I've been playing. You know, yeah, you, you playing in the league, league now, so I'm used to saying like hundred bands, two hundred bands. Like, now you gotta act like you don't know. But it's niggas that bet twenty bands on shooting contests in the gym. You see what I'm saying? Like. I know niggas that used to play in the league that'll come in there with 20 bands cash. That be like, be. now I still could shoot this thing if anybody want to shoot this thing. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't going to tell you who they are. I'll right. let them hustle you that day. Yeah, right. man, on but they'll real City life, vibe, man, man, they'll come in there with a Louis bag. And I'll be like, why you got a Louis bag? Because I got 60 bands say I'll bust all y'all. What you talking about? Man, and it be I like, don't. do you got 60 bands to put up? Like, you know what I'm saying? But I'm used to that, that energy. Hey. I ain't got 60 but that bands energy up. is dope when it's like, I like that pressure, that fight or flight shit. feeling of my homie got 20 bands on this and he think I'm going to beat this man one on one. And I have to win. And we gonna bro. split it down the middle. He definitely giving me a piece of it. Go on, stupid. No, I'm telling you. Like, but I, I used so to we love that. Lose. Like, y'all ever, ever play? Anybody ever played y'all for y'all shoes? Hell no. Nah. nah, these bitches ain't coming off, but we'll play doing, though. You ain't hear what I said. I've been, been doing comedy the entire off. time. But that's what I'm saying. Even do, <laughs> but even while I was hooping, I was rapping while we walked home, eating sunflower seeds. Straight comedy. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't never had I that. am the black mamba of like comedy. After you hooped yeah. Nothing what? else mattered, bro. I used to get up and talk shit. Boy, you ugly as hell. Fuck everybody. Let's go get to school. Get this shit. <laughs> Breakfast, spoken. lunch, dinner. When the teacher said be quiet, I used to whisper to the nigga, boy, you ain't never gonna do shit. Your mama, hoe, you got black hair, cheap ass shoes, the not Jordan nigga, got Jordan dashes on. Come with your shoes, girl. All this type of shit. I was ignorant everywhere. I was ignorant where I wasn't supposed to be. I was ignorant at church. I've been ignorant. I, I was so I ain't even cashed in on all of it yet. <laughs> if you think I'm ignorant now, wait till I get the opportunity. This is just, <laughs> this, this is was all work. my audition. This light work. I'm telling you. <laughs> you ain't, <laughs> you ain't seen a nigga be ignorant like I'm gonna be. Wait till the real money come. You ain't even heard the shit that I got in the vault. I got some shit so fucked up, I have to pull it out of here now and then just to read it, make sure it's still fucked up. I can't drop this shit. <laughs> this, I got a, what? You feel like him with the music. Like, well, no, I, I can't some, put this I, one I out. got some shit that the world, I'm like, ooh, don't say that. Say I'm talking that. about the joke so cold I can't say it out loud. I just have to read it off the paper. <laughs> 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 You gotta hit it, bro. It's in the same place. <laughs> How you put it back in the draw, bro? How you put it back in the draw? Oh my lord. Put a little bow on that back in these streets. I got a month. I can't do it nowhere unless I'm getting paid a lot of money. I'm telling you, this bitch gonna fuck the game up. Go crazy. I'm glad I do comedy because I would have been selling cocaine. Ooh, but shit wait. like that, like trying. Uh uh, shit like even shit like that, bro. It's like that shit was I hate, me. I hate, I hate acting like I don't know who had to do that. Right. I hate acting like I don't know the niggas that. Like you know how I feel to bring your homies to a college campus and then they sit you down and be like, "What you doing?" Like we don't know what you getting into around here. I'm like these my people. What y'all talking <laughs> about? Like oh I know. But they looking at me like I'm I'm like, gee, this is like these your my, family. Yeah, like bro, this is who I call, this is who come to the game, sit in the crowd, like, you know what I'm saying? Like I, what I'm gonna do, like, hey man, y'all don't smoke weed because I don't want them to it's so what? They smoke weed before they got here. So what, bro? Like they here to watch the game, man. So what? They supposed to drink a big beer? If they drink a beer and they hit and red in the face, everybody cool with it. But if they smoke and they chilling, you mad. Wow. But if they smoke a square, they could smoke a square outside. It's just like, in my mind, I, I, I couldn't figure it out. I'm like, gee, I, I came up here late at night, I was in the gym, and the same niggas that they say is bad influence on me, they got me in the gym, they rebounded for me. Bunch of street niggas <clears throat> rebounding, kicking it out. 
Right. You know what I'm saying? They, I ain't had these certain plays down, but I, I wanted to know the play. So I got these niggas running the offense with me to where they now understand. Bro, they understand wait, the basketball. Wait, you got street niggas in the gym. Georgia, hold up, nigga. Me. Wait, now come through here. You got to come. Oh, Bro, I, I would love to see that. I was playing for Georgia Tech, so off the screen. I can't tell <laughs> what I'm supposed to do. Tell you got to come around off the screen. Iman, I watch. You got to come around. And you get that too. Come here, come here, come here. They all coaches. Fuck, fuck. Oh, man. <laughs> You ain't even <coughs> came to the game yet. You got to come off the screen. I'm hey, hey, bro, on some real oh, niggas. Oh, they doing the that. They, hey, doing, they like, and tuck your elbow real in. Real nigga shit. Like, you when you come off the screen, they you like, come, come through his shoulder, bro. You come come straight through him. Take go right on the run. Don't cut him. But it helped me. Like, it gave you that motivation. Them niggas got to come to the game me, after that. Gives me a, that gives me a confidence of saying, no, I've seen, like, I know where you're supposed to be. If right. if if he can remember it. You should be able to remember it. Right. Like, that make me think that But I can't, I also forget. can't, I can't, I can't come in, screen, like, who else, crowd. who else can I get on my team, my teammates uh, at Georgia Tech, who I'm going to hit at, after I went out to the club, hey, say, man, come, come to the gym, come to the gym with me. You going to go? Hell no, nah, because you probably be slizzled on the hell right. of the age. Girls, hey, bro. No, real talk, my coach of them nah. called me, it was girls and heels on the sideline. My homies there, and they was real life. Like my 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 big homie, rest in peace to him. My, my Billy Taylor was like, "Who you gonna be?" You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I yeah, we was talking shit at the club. They was selling, you know, a couple of uh little uh little boo, you know, little boo uh from Boo and Gotti. Y'all remember? Yeah, boo? Mm-hmm. from Chicago. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 that's, that's my big homies. Like, it, niggas. They like, you know what I'm saying? Man, I, I'll shoot you anytime, you know what I'm saying? I remember when Wayne had me on the tour bus, like, you just gave North Carolina 30. I'm telling you, Sean, I, I really could I really could not get down. I really could. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, Sean, I love how you did. I told him I put bet on the game. Like, Harrison Barnes then was on the bus. I told him, but y'all ain't do that with Sean. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> right. so yeah. it was like, they, they want to come to the gym. They like, Sean, can you open the gym? It's 2 in the morning. I don't care. I came here to hoop, bro. Right. I'm going to the gym, but I also can't tell my teammate who's struggling to write a paper, like he, you know what I'm saying? He got to study right now. I right. can't be like, hey man, come to the gym. We finna be in the gym. Like now I'm, now I'm being detrimental to you. The niggas right. would have came if you told them Lil Wayne was there. But that's what I'm saying. Like I like papers and shit. Like I don't like tests. Right. <laughs> I don't like if you test me and tell me that this is what the answer has to be. Cause nine times out of ten, I'm probably not gonna agree with it. Like, right. unless it's like math or some shit. Like, when it be open-ended, I just be like, that's wrong. But I know it's C, but right. that's wrong. <laughs> but I'll mark it for you on your little dumbass Scantron. Like, <laughs> I read shit. it, but it's some bullshit. Like, I don't agree with this philosopher at all, but cool. Like, if that's what my mama gonna hang on the fridge, let's get it over with, type shit. Right. If I can get that done, like, I wasn't failing shit. I ain't never been no academic nothing. I've always been... At Tech, I think I was dean's list for two quarters, like two two semesters. I really Talk wasn't shit, trying to. Man. I could have, but it was like, gee, I'm trying to hoop. Like, right. I'm, I can't. I'm not faking it. Like, I'm doing the papers. I'm doing the work and shit. And if I if I really went hard and like really went hard for the A, I could have got it. But I just was like, first thing come to my mind. You know what I'm saying? Explain myself in the <clears> paper. <throat> hand it in. Whatever the grade is, I know I could play. You know what I'm saying? Like I, 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 I could hold on to this information. I'll memorize this for the week. Right. We gonna knock out this test. I forgot all that shit. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I kept what I needed. I kept common sense and shit that I needed to apply to the world. But I don't remember that shit. Right. I, I remember, you remember going to the. I told you to come off the screen. How you come off the screen? <laughs> you got to go over. You hear me? <laughs> Shut <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> Oh, damn. Oh, he keep being trying to take the test. <laughs> real talk, no, like, like, that's what I would think of, like, for real, though, like, <laughs> like, girls would really be texting me, I can't believe you had all them in the gym, like, that's crazy, y'all, y'all be doing that? I'm like, I do, my peoples do, like, they'll do, do some shit. Do what they want. Yeah, they used to be doing that, man, KG will be in here slapping the floor right now, son. You have a couple drinks, now you don't want to work hard. You know what I'm saying? So I'm in that motherfucker hitting push-ups and shit. That's somebody that don't want to see you fail. See, they know yeah, where you come like, from and they know what you're doing. They like Kobe take ice baths. Hey, you ain't man, even taking an ice bath. What the fuck is this footage? Huh? 
I want. That's not my CTV. That's what man. That is. Shit. I had a mixtape in college that dropped. That nigga, it was four in the morning. Drunk Twelve basketball. niggas just left the club. Lil Wayne. One in nigga in got the dress gym. shoes oh. and a Versace shirt on. Uh, and, and Mac Man Coming came. Up Mac Man. Up. They covered up the whole floor. Look, Mac Man was in that shoe. This like shit like I said, that, that New Jack Mac City man, vibe. Yeah. Nigga, they're playing with the hard bottles Ooh. on the slide Ooh. on ostrich low. Lil was in money. Mac Man is in that bitch. I know Mac Man saw right here. Mac Man saw. They was, but that's, but that's that what just that, make Mac it was make them even saying. More it was religion. them saying, "You come to my concerts and shit. I, I can't support you." Yeah, I'm in town right now. I can't come to the game on Tuesday. Right. Let's go to the gym. You want to go to the gym? I'm like, y'all be in the gym. They like, cool, nigga. We going to the gym. And I right. was like, yo, y'all some solid niggas, bro. Come on with. Yeah, they was in there doing. You know what I'm saying, fucking with the weight room. They like, damn, y'all got. Pff. They going through the locker room doing what you talk about some busted niggas. They doing the same shit like, damn, y'all got all these soaps? <laughs> they like, they like, nigga, what? They like, let me get one of these towels, sure. I told you, nigga. They like, shut up, you got, you got the key to the equipment room. Damn, man, y'all got, let me get a shirt, shut fuck. I get a jersey, fuck it. Going like, crazy. But it was like, it was dope. It shit? was dope because they was just like, gee, like, we get to meet you guys and see you guys and we all yeah right. we all out here trying to look cool for the moment and it was cool for them to just be like gee we, we leaving the club but fuck it we not finna go to sleep and you know the girls will be there that's right. how they we felt like they was like let's go to the gym it's the only time we're gonna have we're gonna be out by tomorrow so it was like it was just cool as fuck and genuine as fuck they was rebounding from me they talking shit at one point I had like three niggas got me, but it's this mixed in with my homies from back home. Right. So now we playing pickup games. It's Going it's a 32. Two. Yeah, like it's 32. It's 20, 20, 20 niggas standing under the rim. We playing every man. Under the rim. Everybody playing got a different whole shit. game. Boy, security, <laughs> 17 <laughs> niggas on this the team. Security, 13 see niggas the footage, on this man. Team. No, because was, you had Georgia Tech. Well, I was in so much trouble, man. Everybody, we all had tickets. On Look, Shump, you can't have gutter gutter in this motherfucker <laughs> at three in the morning. <laughs> Who in the fuck is Mac Jermaine? <laughs> and there was just some guy named Little Wizard or something, Little Wheezy. <laughs> Who the fuck are these guys? They're not on scholarship. They're not supposed to be here. They parked the fucking tour bus right in front of the fucking arena. <laughs> That's exactly what happened. It smells like marijuana in here. <laughs> You told me you had a fucking Lil Wayne concert in here? Uh, uh, a Lil Wayne right. concert? It was Lil Wayne, gutter gutter, <laughs> some guy named Mac Jermaine. Nah, but real soft. He girl, had a guy named gutter gutter. I had a gutter gutter. I had a black, I had a black coat, so he ain't deliver it like that. Fucking Nicki Minaj. Did she suck everybody? What, what happened in here last night? Where are all our t-shirts? What, what happened with who? Who's this fucking all our t-shirts? Where are the towels, man? Where the GT towels? No man. towels, no t-shirts. What the <laughs> fuck, <laughs> yo? But it was like it was. It was really <laughs> like that. <laughs> Who used all this fucking soap? <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious, though. I was getting in trouble for shit like that, and it looked. It looked to them, it was like, why you got these type of people around you? And I'm like, gee, because they tell me to go to the gym. Yeah. Like, other people tell me, hey, study, make sure you're hitting them books. Because it's like, you damn near telling me to bet against it's not going to happen for me, so I need this backup plan. Mm -hmm. Man, right. that's exactly what Kobe I was came, about to say, nigga, man. Kobe came, nigga, Kobe. nigga, you in the league, you a champion, nigga, fuck the school. Kobe, Ooh. nigga, Ooh. do just Kobe enough said some to real go to the league, nigga, fuck all that dirty uh -huh. shit. If you don't believe in your talent, pick your books up. If you want to go to the league, nigga, do just enough. <laughs> <laughs> fuck an A, nigga, you going to the league, you see your feet. jump with that bitch icy, nigga. Fuck you, don't you, need, you don't need no A when your shit icy, nigga. Is he seeing icy? I see. I see. <laughs> and when you get a D, you been playing defense. defense. Boy, you an all defensive team. But if you get an L, you can't get the fuck out the way. You got a foul. That's the free throw. You keep fucking up. Check. You play another team. You, you get the fuck out of here. That's what y'all got out of here. Fuck school. Man, school is a ripoff. Nigga in the lead, nigga. Made way more money anyway. in the lead than at school, nigga. <laughs> This is what I'm talking about, man. Sure, he can't eat no books. I got it. Damn, I can't tell that. <laughs> Can I tell my Kobe story? Go ahead. Oh, oh, yeah, you got to tell your Kobe story. Quite on the set. Look, oh, Kobe no, story. No, no. I done told it, I done told it before, but it's, it's Kobe came to our high school and was like, uh, I never understood that, like, you know how he used to deliver it. But he, it was scary to look at Kobe because Kobe, like, looked through you. It's weird. It's like, oof. So, anyway, bone chilling, the way he said it. But he was like, uh, they asked him first, they was like, so what was it like to score 81 
Like, what was going through your head? And he was like, absolutely nothing. You know, we were down, and we had to win. You know, when I looked up, I had, I had what, 76? Like, he was talking like, I don't, I don't know. I was sick in the head. I had to win. If you go back and look, I was losing, and I wanted to win. And he just went off. And he was like, I never understood people saying to me, uh, don't put all your eggs in one basket. He like, why can't I just, you know, that basket don't work and eggs break. Who said I can't make more eggs? Ooh. He was like, what is that mindset? I don't get it. And that shit, it, nigga, like, <laughs> it's like, don't teach me. Oh, you got to hit them books and shit. You know, don't get me wrong. You got to go through school to play ball. Right, right, right. But if I tell you I want to play ball, gas it. Right. Gas it. Yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't lie to me and be like, oh, he the best player in the world. No, but gas it. Yeah, keep going. You're going to have to work. You're going to have to work hard. Yeah, you still going to have to finish your homework. You know what I'm saying? You can't flunk. You still got to, you know what I'm saying? Gotta you got to be able to put the jersey on. You got to be able to put the jersey on. So, boom, you got you to learn a little bit. Right. You know what I'm saying? You got to know how to, how, how to write something off. You know, right. you don't have a lot of money if you're right. going to make it to the league. Like, talk to them like that. Like, make it real to them. Don't tell them, well, what you going to do if, if it don't work out? You know, you know, a large percentage of us don't make it. Right. Like, what type of shit is that? Right. They speak He's from not their gonna, experience. That man's not gonna make it. Right. That dude's not gonna make you it. You're gonna put it in your head. Not if his parents are saying that. Like, that's that's half the battle, bro. It's what you mean? I ain't gonna make it. Like, my dad was like, all right, you just gonna have to do a lot. You gonna have to work. Right. If you short still. You gonna you gotta you gotta be able to. Use your body. You got to be stronger. You're going to have to get in that weight room now. I'm telling you. All right? You're going to have to be able to dunk. I'm telling you. You sound <laughs> like a black fox. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> hey, hey, them boys can jump. You didn't regret. Hey, you hear what I said? Look in my eyes, son. Hey, them boys can jump. That's my you father. You jump, but you have to get to jump. That's, <laughs> hey, and that's him. <laughs> And that's him. Jumping, Real, you, you sitting there like, yeah, right, Real talk. And that's Double how, jump, And man. when your father said to you, though, right. like, I remember when we went to the, I went to my first little thing. I was playing on a little travel team, little right. hood team. And they didn't show up to the game. We went to Wisconsin. Me and my dad already drove. They didn't call nothing. And I had to play with, like, my little brother, my homie's little brother, my homie that wasn't supposed to play, and he was just coming to watch. Right, and you some, always got some right. extra niggas with and you. Some kid, and some kid That's out the- That's a lesson. Some I'm not kid, letting that shit slide. Some kid out the crowd that lent somebody some shoes that he had in the car, so we let him play. Dang. And I had to play a real team. And I was like, my, I told Pop, like, bro, what are we even doing? Like, you know what I'm saying? And he came up to me, he was like, I already paid for the tournament. The only way I get my money back is if you win. You telling me you can't beat them? I'm like, Pop, they got a whole team. They got warm-ups on, dog. What you, this AU type shit, bro. What you, you know what I'm saying? That's how I'm looking at him. Like, bro, you got me with my little brother, bro. This nigga, he don't even want to play. He just, like, happy to put a jersey on type shit. Like, right. but he wasn't into it, really. He joked, dog, when the 2-3 zone we had set up, bro, they laughing and shit. Like, <laughs> we about to do these niggas right. type shit. <laughs> like, well, we about to do these niggas. My little brother looking like, yeah, like, he 10 years old. Like, he One catch the ball, I'm like, shoot it, shoot. he just throw it. But I'm just like, if he shoot it and it land here, I could get it type shit. Like, and I'm, bro, no bullshit, bro. I beat three teams. I got to the finals and lost. But I beat three teams dolo, like 50, 60, right. whatever I had to do. I was just doing it all because my dad looked me dead in my eye. I was like, so you telling me somebody over there could stop you? And it was the challenge, like, nigga, I ain't say all that. I said, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I said, team against team, we yeah. might lose. You line them niggas up, I'm clearing it. He liked them clear it. Fuck Ooh. you talking about? That like, nigga was out there balling with the like Mike Chucks on. Like, yeah. like, even, but during the game, he wasn't even like really coaching. He like, it's okay. It's okay. Like, but he knowing you dolo out here, shorty. Right. Like, Count your put, it, put it in the hoop. Like, I don't want to hear it. Like, we. We already drove two hours. Like, you gonna do this to these people. Like, <laughs> and it was just, I don't know. Patient, like, bro. but when it, that like, that's real to me. Like, right. that was like, that's how I got here. So I'm like, when I'm thinking about parents, I'm like, dude, why would you tell your kid, like, to have a backup? Gas, whatever they plan is. Right. That's why so many kids get to college. Like, what you wanna do? And they go, I don't know what I wanna do. That's cause somebody told them to go to school till they figured it out. And, no, nah, this nigga really, might really like video games. Nigga, let that nigga it. play video games. It's a, it's a check over there. 
he could learn how to really build a video game forward and back. Cool, learn about video games. He like cameras. He always picking up your camera. Boy, don't touch that. No, let him touch. Tell him what to do with it. He like it. He might be the best photographer ever. He might got the eye that you never had, right. even though you a photographer. Whatever, gas it. Like, I watch Junie pick up stuff all the time, Joe, and she just get good at shit. We got her a gymnastic bar. This little girl doing flips and routines, and Going I'm crazy. like, gee, I didn't teach her none of that. I don't know how to do none of that. She making moves, but she going on YouTube asking Siri, hey Siri, pull up some gymnastic girls. Going what crazy. outfits do they wear? Mommy, I need a leotard. <laughs> then her mama like, I'm gonna get you a sparkly one. Then, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, Joe, just gas them. Gas these kids, let them do whatever, because that's all I was. like. Nigga, you always had niggas that you, I know if, well, I don't know if y'all was hooping, but I was hooping. I tried. So Girl, niggas hit me with this. I was hooping. Yeah. Niggas hit me with this. Hey, man, after they would see me play, hey, man, stay in school, try and stay out the streets. Now, I know, but just stay out the streets, but don't never put that ball down. Fuck you talking about? You're like, you don't want to do this. I'm doing this. I wanted to do that. Do that. You do that. You know what I'm saying? I was at the party with my homies. We, we done flushed the nigga. Ah, ah, ah. They, they, man, get out of here. They finna start. You get out of here. Get him out of here first. Get, right. him, get him out of here. I'm like, then why these my homies, bro? Because they like, nigga, you not finna get in trouble. You got a chance, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Right. You got a shot. I ain't never been I that, that good. Nigga. I have never been that you good. Got, so you got a chance to be never. something for us. Niggas was like, yeah, you, you don't want to do home. this, but you ain't going to do that either, nigga. You got to figure something else out. I played ball when I got locked up, and they were like, yeah, take his ass to jail. <laughs> That's just how sorry I right. was. I'm like, I play ball. They were like, we don't give a fuck. <laughs> That's that nigga said, girl. play for hey, your shoes. Right. I ain't never had no shoes no nigga wanted to play me y'all for. Got, it was like, you keep them. Man. Man. No, it's just a disrespect thing. <laughs> yeah, but see, a nigga ain't even taking like, time out to play I remember no playing a dude, like I played a dude for his Vince Carters, and I never could wear them because they was too small for me. My homie got them. Took you just walk anyway. around put the on with his shoes put like Debo. I put them on my neck. We oh, home. this nigga done made a chain out of nigga's shoes. But it's... Hey, but you said <laughs> niggas in the street used to always tell you to stay in school like you was going to have a good game on Friday night. Like, man, fuck school. <laughs> but they be, they be doing that. They be like, hey, man, stay in school. Because they know if you stay in school, they really just telling you at least 8 to 3, we know you ain't in trouble. Mm-hmm. We're going to tell you that. <laughs> we That's know really what good. they tell you. 8 to 3, at least somebody got an eye on you, man. We know you good. It's a chaperone. Yeah. 8 to 3, you got a chaperone, you nigga. You, you like good. basketball? Cool. Now 3 to 6. You yeah. occupied, nigga. After you might six, be tired. Go home. You gotta eat. Go you home. ain't got no money, so you gotta eat. Mama gonna cook. You gotta get to the crib, nigga. You gonna be alright. Right. Stay in school and keep playing ball. And it, and I realized, like, gee, I don't get to the house till it's late. Let me ask you this. And you out the this, way out of everything. This been too. a hot time. And I'm tired, you, so I'm going right. Do to you see. think they should pay college athletes? No. Really? I like that. Cause it, it really? stop. It stop them. It if, stop. If they would have paid, them. listen, this how I feel. If they'd have paid Mike them, you could have paid us. But y'all ain't paid them. Don't pay them. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like, why should these kids get paid and get corrupted early? No, oh, bro. You got to play pure basketball. That's why people still like college. It's pure basketball. It ain't no kid with 40 million in his pocket that's going to, you say something to him, maybe, how much you make? Well, the crazy part about it, nigga get to the league, don't even be that fat. Sometimes. <laughs> but even if you think they don't get paid, do you think they should get penalized for? Let a nigga buy him some chicken wings and no, shit like stupid. that. <laughs> you know what I mean? I can get him paid, but a nigga bought me up some hurls, and now I can't play no more. Yeah, I think some of that shit is stupid. But they don't, tell you the truth, they, the NCAA is not like that. They chasing niggas and shit for that shit. It be, sometimes it be shit, you either do some dumb shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Either you do some dumb shit, you constantly in trouble, and they just like, we can't do it no more. We got to slap you on the wrist at some point. You know what I'm saying? Like. But they not really looking to disqualify guys and shit. It's just they got to put that rule in there because there's so many people that'll give you 100 bands, 200 bands, street money, and now it's clean money on the flip because you got to pay them back because remember when I gave you that? They really protecting players, you know what I'm saying? Not even just street money. You may have a large corporation, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, Pringles may say, hey, man, I, I feel bad putting that on Pringles. I like Pringles. Right. No, I don't but, put no money up, bro. They ain't not gonna pay me. They might. That's cool. If they you know don't you fuck like with Pringles. me, if you don't fuck with me for this real nigga example, at least I said Pringles. Like, uh, okay. At least you got some. Good, all good press, bad press. I mean, all bad, any press is good press. You yeah, that shit. Whatever, whatever the Kardashian, whatever them white girls what, say. What did it start with Pringles? 
When, when did this happen? No, nah, for sure. You, you mean to tell mustache, me? Though, Listen, no, them, them, you mean to tell me your mind sharp and loves Pringles and nobody fucking reached that <laughs> many Pringles? Maybe it gets to that. That's how all the niggas with money talk. When, 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 did, when did this happen? I feel oh, bad, though. The Kardashians <laughs> gave me that. Like, all good press is, all press is good press or well, whatever. Maybe. Whether it's good or bad, like, whatever. But if maybe. I, that, I don't forgot the example. No, nah, you were nah, talking about if Pringles wanted to get you a check. Now you was talking about kids oh, getting paid. Oh, kids getting paid, yo. I've been saying this funny thing. This crazy hell. <laughs> if Pringle wanted to. <laughs> if Pringle Let's get wanted, some Pringles. All right, all right, go ahead, bro. <laughs> if Pringle wanted to give a kid money right. now, knowing this is an investment later, they don't want a kid getting into the league, and now your first check is getting divvied up. Right. The league is all about that balance because they've had so many guys come in the league and you taking care of all your homies and, and moms that did this and that for you. But if they put just that fear in you of, you know, you can get disqualified, now you even have a way out to tell the homies that's trying to do it. Right. You may feel pressured in, I don't want to take money from you because you starting to see like this man trying to like have me under his wing right. where, you know what I'm saying, I owe him a check. Like, right. You just be like, man, you know what I'm saying? I can't get disqualified, bro. Like, so you know really what I'm saying? They the gave you a, yeah, it give you a wall. So it's like, if you can't, deal with that wall man you got an issue you've been broke your whole life you're gonna be straight yeah i mean i still think they should get some type of stipend though because maybe know they I mean? should get a, maybe they should get something later on yeah. whatever they make so much money off them college athletes maybe it's man. some shit I, I, maybe they should do some shit where it take your colleague the money you helped win the, the college and you know what i'm saying the boosters however that does maybe they all get a percentage of that it divvies up and then five years removed y'all get the money or some shit like yeah. that like but it, it just can't be you see it in your account while you're a college kid. It's just turn you into a different animal. Right. Like it was different for me to have dropped 30 and then still broke. You know what I'm saying? Like it's something about that grind that if you I gotta achieve it. If I got 30 and I got bread, what I'm doing tonight? <laughs> Some dumb shit. And then the crazy part is you got 30 and you do got bread. <clears throat> just a loaf of bread. That's all you got at the room is a loaf of bread. Oh, oh, oh. That's it. You That's going it. back to the room making straight bread sandwiches all 30 oh, points. Peanut butter. Rob, yeah. be, no peanut butter, no Top jelly, Rob. just no, bread. The bread. <laughs> Niggas is cutting bread down the middle. Nigga, right. mouth stuck to yell. All on pause. Right, nigga. From earlier today. Nah, but I, was, I told you, I'm an entrepreneur kid, man. Right. I, was, I was top ramen, you know, with the little Doritos on it and shit, flaming hot. So you, you were stacking them. Nigga was eating like he was in Throw prison. Throwing the meat on that pause. Gotta, you gotta cut the hot dogs ground beef. up in it. Yes, nah, sir, nah, I'm a ground beef guy. Ground beef? Niggas oh, eating. I can't, I can't. Jail, jail. the hot dog. You was a boiled hot dog kid, Yes, sir, skinny. I can't cook no ground beef. I done burnt all the ground beef. I know that kid. But see, that made me feel like I know this nigga. Ground beef look like raisins. My cousin, my cousin wanted bull. He want the bull hot dog. That's. That's what he want. A boiled hot dog. That's the glizzy right there. That's, that's what he want, G. Like, Good growing glizzy. up, that's what he on. Like, Ma be like, hey, man, pause. He be like, man, do whatever you got to do, bro. Give me a, a give me a hot dog, boil that motherfucker. Give me, a, give me a Polish man. Give me, y'all get it, I get it, I'm gay, I get it. Boy, give me a Polish. Know, <laughs> they be doing that. They be like, I ain't finna Polish shit. I like Polishes. Fuck that. That's how they be. Give me only mustard on my shit. Put onions on it. On my soul. Give me. I want a little bit of that. That little burnt line. I need that on mine, baby. Yeah. Thank you. Burnt off the my board. Shit open, yeah, they call bro, it split it. My soul, split it, let it, let it, let it fly. Butterfly mm. my shit one time. That's a Thank hot dog you, man. I got to go to Chicago if you can burn a hot dog boil in it, nigga. Them mm -hmm. niggas got a special technique. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm the saying, I'm saying the, the water done boiled down. Oh, the no, no, no. A hot dog in the Polish, the Polish we do on the grill. That's what I was, I was going into that. We, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, if you burning a boil hot dog, you do it a terrible. I was going to say, you don't wait till the stove came back. That water done evaporated. You left that a little too long, brother. Been so dumb, she burnt the boil hot dog. Oh, it's stinking that rule, my soul. But it's like, gee, if you, you gonna have to see y'all do this every time. I can't even did, break. Man, man. I'm trying to make my point. You get all y'all funny nah, shit. Nah, you were talking about the hot, not having no bread, scoring 30. Oh, yeah, scoring 30. Y'all yeah, yeah, good at that. Man, I'm with you, bro. We keep it up. We keep it up, bro. We, 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 I've been locked in ever since you was like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that nigga got some emotion. You got to pay attention. You got to pay attention. You got to pay attention. That's crazy. That's why y'all get paid to do this shit. We on bullshit. No, no, Look no. Look at Marvin no. Gaye. See, he told you. Yeah. <laughs> he just found out them niggas were cold. This yeah. nigga. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, man. Y'all official as fuck. Y'all steady yeah, ring. We just look like this. Hey, we, we need a championship ring. We need a championship ring. Yeah, we just look like this. I'll bring it in one day. I'll bring it in one day. Yes, sir. I, I got a question for you, though. Like, what's that moment in the league where you just knew, like, nigga, I'm that nigga? What was that moment? Like, is this uh, gotta be some moment when you playing? 
that let you know, even what you have in the perspective you have and not giving a fuck and being a team player, what was that moment when you just like, nigga, I'm in the league, I'm up? We played, um, well, first, it was my first bucket made me feel like that, cause. First one ever? Yeah, my first bucket, I did like this little in and out and then a pro hop. Somebody fouled me and my first bucket was an and one. Mm. And I just, something about it, like, you know, we always say three the hard way and shit. And it was just like, I felt like it was so, that was my life. Like, broken play happens. You know what I'm saying? Some bullshit always happened. And I end up getting control somehow. And then I have to make something out of nothing. And it turned into something better than we wanted in the first place. And mm -hmm. I'm like, that's like my whole life, bro. And it was like that that was the first time I scored. And it was like I had a moment where I like punched the the little post under the rim. I punched it and I'm just like, damn, that shit just blew my mind. It felt like deja NBA. vu type shit. Yeah, I was like, damn, I'm here, shorty. Like, and I'm on the free throw line after that. They were like, oh, you turned that, you done hit you a layup, you turned. But they didn't understand what it was for me to where I just started talking my shit. And then after that, I had hurt my knee in that game, sprained some, and they told me, you're going to be out for three weeks. they like, that's, that's yeah, you're going to have to sit down. And I came back in like a week. I put the brace on, and I was like, fuck that. I'm already in shape. It's over. Fuck right. that. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm 21 up. years old. Fuck that. Let's go. And I played, and I got a couple of steals, and I got dunks, and I got the chance, because they booed me when I got drafted. So I got the chance to, like, yell at the crowd. So I was like, I wasn't holding back. Like, I was saying what I wanted to say. Man, fuck y'all. Y'all wanted him. Y'all wanted him. Mm -hmm. Fuck him. Like, Miles was thinking, you thinking that I'm like talking shit about them, but mm -hmm. I'm like talking shit to the crowd. Like, bro, y'all ain't even want me. Why y'all, why y'all clapping, G? Right, right. What you clapping for? You don't even, yeah. You don't even fuck with me. Yeah, like I, ain't, uh, I ain't even. I'm on the free throw line saying anything to niggas. Niggas say, oh, what you say? What? All right, I'll fuck around and miss the free throw too, trying to talk too much shit. Like, what? Man, you ain't never. I've been waiting. I've been waiting, bro. I've been, I watch your footage more than you. Fuck. Fuck. Ah, shit, that's cool. We still gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> Real talk. That's a nigga, that's a nigga <laughs> doing. Talk, Miles be mad at me. Be like, Shump, you, what you talking about right now, man? You, you, you three for eight. So? Nigga, Bello got 40. You mad. <laughs> you mad. They ain't pick you up, shorty. They pick me up at 17. They ain't pick you up, huh? Lame ass. You a lame. Like, but that's how I was playing, because I was like, at that point, I'm like, y'all don't even want me. So what I ain't trying to impress y'all right now. Right. Then I fell in love with the city. But it was like, I think it was the the game we played. I can't say who it was, because I really don't want to start no beef. No, it's all good. After I finished my last contract, then I'll start really revealing. Right. Like, <clears throat> who niggas was, yeah. Right. I don't want to do that. But at the time, there was a better draft pick. Mm -hmm. Played him. He was not a better draft pick. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And I had that moment to just confirm the niggas, like, I'm him. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, we was on the road, too, and I'm looking at the crowd like, huh, you picked him. Huh. <laughs> like, y'all picked him, Joe. No, he ain't that. He, I'm him. I'm him. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm him, bro. Like, I don't even, I don't know if I'm classified. I don't know what I am, honestly. Like, you him. Him. Right. I like, You're a champion. I don't know the category I'm supposed to be. You're a champion. Him. You know who you are. What it is. He's fucking a champion. Chip. Him. Hey, hey. You telling hey. me we had gutter gutter in here? Hey, <laughs> some guy named fucking Mac Jermaine. <laughs> <laughs> All I know, man, is I feel like way more people in the world right. can relate to somebody like me that you don't know how to turn it off or you ain't. I'm just the one that got in. Like I got, I played the right people at the right time. It lined up. I caught a growth spurt. Like it all lined up. But I kicked it like 80% of black people that do. Like, right. What y'all do? Go hoop <laughs> all day. Then go play football with your homies if they play football. Like I was playing baseball. I don't play baseball, but I could knock one out the park for the sure, show because my homie play. Yeah, I can't. I don't play football, but. If you throw it up there, it's not a lot of niggas that's gonna outjump me for that ball. Right. You know no what I'm boy. saying? Right. You got one of the craziest dunks ever, right. nigga. That's that what I'm saying. Back it's in not New York. many niggas like you like the shit Odell Beckham and shit. Like, I be when that nigga came, nigga came like from that, back bro. here and mm, I was like, oh. Trying to do all that. Like when we was playing, I was trying to catch pass like that. Odell hands just like this big. 
hand, shake your hand, and shit, touch your goddamn <laughs> forearm. Oh, damn, like, hey, how you doing? How you doing? That, right. shit, that shit irregular. That's what I mean. It's like, yeah, that's all yeah, I don't yeah, mean. Like, that fun. nigga hand is ridiculous. That's how he caught that shit. It was ridiculous. But I I always play whatever the homies, whatever we doing, we doing that. Y'all like rapping, we rapping. We got a rap group, let's rap. Fuck. And then niggas was like, yo, you rap, rap. I'm like, yeah, nigga, I've been rapping since I was a kid. Right. You know what I'm saying? But anything we was trying to do, we was going to do it. Because it's like, gee, if we shoot enough of these missiles into the air, we going to hit something. Some. Fuck. Some if I shoot 30 of these bitches into a house, you telling me ain't nobody going to get hit? Somebody. Somebody. You see what I'm saying? And that's how we felt. Like, how do we kick the door down and get past this? Like, why? Well, I don't want to see my roof leaking no more. I don't want right. to see that shit. How the fuck I'm going to do it? Boom, I don't know. They said I can't. Ain't nobody made it from Oak Park. Ain't nobody made it to the league. Cool, I'm still shooting that missile. Oh, ain't nobody rapping. They ain't going to shoot. Fuck it. We shooting that. Right. Ain't nobody got no clothes on. We shooting that. Right. Fuck it. Like, I, I don't care, G. However many. <laughs> You put enough real estate in the sky, somebody gonna have to rent something. You dig what I'm saying? <laughs> nigga, you saying. gonna have to rent something, That's my nigga. You gonna have to shop with me at the wild. I burn CDs. You dig <laughs> what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? I, I go do spoken word with you, I'll rap with you, I'll hoop, I can make clothes with you. What you want? Baby, your car stop, you pop the hood. Shorty, I know how to do this. Look, you ain't even know this stick right here. If it go to this line, baby, right here, you straight. If it's under that line, baby, this is bone dry. You killing your car. See what I'm saying? You need to drink water, this need to drink oil. You see what I'm saying? Let's go in the store. I'm going to walk you through this. I, I, you know what I'm saying? A lot of niggas don't know how to do that, bro. A lot of niggas don't know how to change nigga, They yeah, can't man. change a tire. Fuck Real life about. NBA 2K created nigga. Like, this you nigga can't, you can't change a tire, bro. We finna triple A. You don't even know you got a tire under your car and come standard, nigga. This right. is a SUV. You fucking serious? <laughs> That's the whole point you got this motherfucker, bro. It's right here up under your car. Fuck you mean? Your shirt that clean, bro. You can't get out the car, you know what I'm saying? Like, mine's are really sitting in the car in the NBA. I'm going to call AAA, I'm going to have nobody seeing me. Seeing me change a tire, that's the most regular nigga shit in the world. I'm not finna pay this man $500 to be a better man than me, bro. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> my father, my father would never respect me, my nigga. If the car got a spare tire, G, I'm changing the tire. If I got a jack, if somebody got a jack, we whatever, bro. If we got to go to the to the store, I'm I'm not embarrassed at all to change no tire, bro. Everybody catch a flat tire, my nigga. Regular nigga. Real, Real nigga, talk, man. like I'm gonna pay baby. this man five hundred to a thousand. What you crazy part about you getting you the tire changed? That that's a lot, nigga. But the crazy part, the but it's still no. But I'm saying, wait. I'm saying if Just you got a general. if you got a call for somebody to come up there, what if I got to tow the car? To somewhere, they're gonna have to tow it. You're gonna have to pay for the gas to get to whatever place they need the tires. And you from. got it to do it, but I refuse. But it's like, bro, do all of that when I have a spare tire that came with this, when however much check. the car was. Like, all athletes, I'd say, is gonna drive in a hundred thousand range car at least. If you spent a hundred bands, you don't think that bitch come with a spell? That shit came with yeah, me. Exactly. I, that motherfucker. I hope that motherfucker. That motherfucker you caught a flat? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Real talk, you need uh, folks, man. Bands. I'm gonna that call me before that bitch get flat. Mr. Miller, we feel like you're gonna experience some service to that bitch. You got right. the shit that's pulling up right it. behind you. Thank you so much. You got the shit that's <laughs> gonna say it. Ding, ding, ding. Your tire pressure low. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that bitch, hey, when yeah. your tire really fucked up, that shit don't work but like I know that. Some niggas, like, I know some niggas that are real life, before they even go even get down to do anything, they right. calling somebody, cutting the AC on, sit back. And Talking it. to a girl. I'm like, well, that's just the blessing of you getting that train. Right. Y'all got, you got me chopped train. up, man. Listen, nah, you but my father would be like, fam, you what? You what? I Boy, you a you pussy. How, I taught you how to. Right. That boy that got that money turned to a pussy. That's how they be, though. If I come you can't on, put the goddamn towel in the car. Uh -huh. what, what you buy the motherfucker for? Huh? <laughs> They're like, boy, I would have loved to have a spare tire. Boy, I ain't Shit. had no spare tire. I had to cut that motherfucker off, take it to the shop boy, myself. I oh, walk. Than that. You should have bought a Chevrolet. Real talk, yeah. though. When we had to fix the flat, like, my, I remember my pops walking me through it in college over and over. Like, man, you know, you just got to get the nugs off. Come on, man. Come, come on. on. Come on, man. Changing tire bro. really is the easy shit. I, to be honest, I like changing tire. It make you feel like a man. I feel like, I, I swear, I, I pull over for a motherfucker. I see it. They be like this. I'm like, yeah, he look like he don't know what he's doing. Let me help my boy. Hey, uh, you have a little, you have a little trouble right now? <laughs> good Samaritan, nigga. Real talk, though. It's, like, it's something so simple, but 
if I don't do, if I don't know how to do that, like I feel like I should be able to do that. I should be able to, like, it feels so good to not be in the league just because I realize how much I pay people just because I'm not there. Mm. Uh Little shit, like, you'll check your invoice. Somebody done made, you done told them to run, get them light bulbs, install some new light bulbs all around the crib, and it'd be a $250 job. Nigga, them light bulbs ain't cost that goddamn much. Right. But you pay for that man time. Mm-hmm. You pay for him to actually have the tool that fit the screw on your light to take the whole fixture down and make the black fixture. You end up paying what, 2500 It's just like, bro, I'm out here paying all this money and doing all this, and it's like, it felt so good for, the, for Corona to hit and be home and realize, like, damn, I'm, I'm thinking in my head, like, damn, I ain't got no job now. I'm finna have to figure, damn, I'm finna have to, uh, uh, all right, cool. Let's, let's see how I'm gonna do this. Right. Let's see how I'm, gonna, how I'm gonna deal with if the NBA don't never come back because this shit get crazy. Like, how does life work, okay? Because right. that's the realistic thought for me as a father. Like, okay, how do this shit work? Boom, right. okay, boom. I start realizing, like, bro, I ain't got to pay a lot of y'all nothing. <laughs> <laughs> So what you doing? Get the fuck out of my house. <laughs> right. You drop them goddamn light bulbs. I got it. Don't worry about it. Fuck them goddamn light bulbs. Look shit, bullshit. though. It's like, bro, hey, DC. get out my kitchen. I cook. DC. Get out my bed. I sleep for myself. Like, and the motherfuckers that work for him, like, man, he got to get back to work. <laughs> right. Damn. He talking about fine motherfuckers and cutting the money. Off. Just, I need that need light bulb. Don't get me wrong. Don't get wrong. Sometimes, sometimes you gonna need a nigga to do some shit. Like, <laughs> Mr. Shumba, you don't want me to fuck with the lights. That what you said? You don't want me to do it. You want me to do it? I want you dog. You want me to do it? I play with it. So even that though. <laughs> hey though, even that though, my nigga. My nigga. I had a big ass. I be had a big ass blue bay shepherd, right? <laughs> you realize how much it costs to have somebody that's gonna walk them all the time, nigga. Just because it's like, he a big ass dog. That's I can't have deal. Tiana grabbing this nigga. He right. gonna rip her arm off. It has to be a man's man. Like, right. But I had to pay. Like I had to pay a dog walker. Cause I ain't at the crib. Big I'm, I'm just when I ask for the dog. And I, I can't pay the bill cause I'm all the way over here doing whatever. And Junie wanna see her dog. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, and it's like, this nigga can't keep flying everywhere with me. Right. He gonna, at some point he gonna be by himself and I'm gonna have to pay somebody or have like, somebody that can that ain't scared of him right. walk him you know what i'm saying and it's just like i start seeing like damn i ain't got to pay a lot of people nothing but I, that's like a an applause for my my father because it's just like gee thank god you ain't like for lack of a better term i know it's ladies in the room but thank god i'm not a bitch like i for real. Man, thank you for not making me a bitch ass nigga I, I he like, work with his hands some bitches it's some what it's some what i hear some female dogs. No, it's it's an arm. <laughs> it was, I, I want the other word. It's some bitches. <laughs> that nigga said that shit hot. It's some bitches. <laughs> it's just a, like it's some dudes that just it's like the they concept of manhood is wrong. Right, they it's can't just, get their fingers dirty. I'd be like, bro, you forgetting this is our whole demo. This is the only reason they like us, bro. Like if you can't do this, you're never gonna have a female, bro. They. <laughs> You thinking you you going it all, your, it's route, all money. No. your route is the wrong way, bro. Like, your bitch like you cutting grass, nigga. You just don't even know it. She wanna talk. see you sweat. And do it before she say something, cause you want the grass cut. Nigga, you, you don't saying? want the grass cut? You ain't or you don't own the house. Talk your shit! Ah, that's the difference. If you don't own the house, ah. you just waiting for somebody to do it. But when you own the house and you see that shit get up and then homeowners hit you with, hey man, that shit making the block look terrible. You better cut that shit. You go, oh, I gotta cut this shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And then you could you could pay another man to be a man for your girl, or you could just Ooh, you you talking shit. Real talk, like, you, you can't. Me, nigga. Niggas at the house sweating and they bitch looking at it like. <laughs> no, nah, for real. Yeah, like, nigga heard that. I'm like, let hey, me go and get the love more straight. Right. Let me go ahead. I'm telling it's you. It's just bro. like the basic concepts of men. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, the Instagram shit ruined it for right. us. Like, it, it raised it for women. Women get, you know what I'm saying? But niggas, like, niggas be like trying to get in where they fit in and shit. Like, nah, we don't live on the gram, bro. That ain't where we living. Talk your shit. You know what I'm saying? That, that, that car fuck up, you live there, bro. You did. Get under that hood. That's 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 your weird, bro. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? That's your commercial right there. The shirt come off, you sweating. You know what I'm saying? You use your nice shirt and you just, you you don't want to touch the oil with your hands, so you using your nice shirt. Hey, you gonna do that with your shirt? Yeah, it's an expensive shirt. Fuck this shirt, man. This nigga, shit, dry right? home shirtless, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
That's your demo though. That's how she gonna fall in love with you. Like, hey, it's a lot of niggas with money. Ain't a lot of niggas gonna fix that car. Fuck you mean? They ain't gonna fix that car. They, gonna put that bitch they not gonna mow that lawn. They don't know how to fix that toilet when these motherfuckers drop that ring in there. It's yeah. rare. They don't know how to do none of that. Yeah, fix that or the drain. That shit go go down the drain. Earring fall down the drain. Can you get that motherfucker out of the drain? You wanted enough. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna. I ain't fuck with them fights. That's what I'm saying though. Can you? It's really. You'll think it's nasty. You'll think it's. I ain't saying it's nasty. I just don't want to fuck up enough. I don't want to be a fuck up. You don't want to be a fuck up, but you gonna allow this nigga who might be a fuck up to do it. No, I I trust him because he's a. All you got. It don't even be learning. I don't know how to cut. He ain't go to school for it. Look, he ain't go to school for it. But literally, if you have a nigga come over one time and the whole time he there, you just watch. Like, let me see what this nigga do. This nigga will unloosen four screws on each side, take that pole out, go like this, the ring come out, mm-hmm. he put the four shits, the four little bolts mm-hmm. back, and you got to pay that man 500. You did this shit, yeah. bro. Let me, let me tell you Shorty, I'm looking like yeah, I'm I, not paying that. When I saw a nigga do that for us in college, we had to call the technician, dude, because we didn't want to <laughs> do it, because we like, you know what I'm saying? This is an uh, institute. If we fuck up doing it and we fuck it up, we're going to have to pay. We broke. We don't know what's going on. We on scholarship. <laughs> yeah. We like, we're going to call them to fix their shit. But I sat there and watched, and I'm like, that ain't shit. No, it ain't. I didn't have to call him. I bet he think less of a man than me. Like He probably think, like, this little young punk. Stupid That's ass. That's crazy. Like, <laughs> I had to do with that. Put a little like, like, you like actually that. got some in this dorm before. You can't fix this. Like, I he probably that. looking at yeah. me like, this soft ass little nigga. Oh, right? this dude, because my grass definitely probably look at me like that, because that shit be high as they a mother, look at I ain't me. never cut grass in my life, Wait, nigga. Never? No, I ain't never had look, grass. And, it, it's and it's something, it's something. You gotta have grass to cut grass. I'm a city nigga. See what I'm saying? I don't know how he learned. I'm gonna wait till all we get off camera. Like, nigga, who taught you how to cut grass? Chicago <laughs> nigga. Like, oh, you, you gotta do it. But I'm saying, in Chicago, you got, you gotta put the oil in. Man, fuck that. You gotta that. hit the choke nope. like three times. You gotta finger nope, the choke. Nope, cause y'all niggas it. who know how to cut grass take that shit too serious. And then look, don't pull the screen too far cause you'll fall. punch yourself in your shit. I feel you. You gotta play with it like. Okay, the ego. Real talk. But soon, oh, soon as I cut the grass, a nigga like y'all that know how to cut grass and come over and judge me. Man, who the fuck cut hey, this shit? Also, nigga, you ain't got hey, no lines or nothing we, in hey, your we grass. We also did that. Asked my dad, like, hey, can I get, you know what I'm saying, enough money to two, two kinks of gas and we gonna cut grass. We gonna rake leaves. You know what I'm saying? A little shit that it's like, the, you not gonna do it because I could see this nigga come out every day with a Bluetooth and a Benz over here. You know what I'm saying? Like, we got to walk past this shit all the time. This nigga got to be in. This nigga's not going to cut his grass. <laughs> hey, Mr. Davis, you need, your, you, need, you need to rake them leaves, get that grass and shit. You, you, you got to pay the messages all the time, man. You, you know what I'm saying? They, right. they fuck, that's a little 20. You know what I'm saying? Then they fuck around, tip you sometimes. Like, here go 50, man. Y'all little niggas, man. Y'all cutting grass, that's dope, man. Y'all staying out of trouble. But it was like anything to get the bag, bro. I shit, feel I you on that. That wasn't my hustle, though. I used to cut the old people grass in my neighborhood for free. Just because we used to trap in front of them. That's oh, a different well, that's type of trap. So I was just like, you know what? Her shit getting, I'm just going to cut it. Motherfuckers see me just dragging my lawn over. They like, Jojo, what you been do? You, you, you ask up for some money? I'm like, nah, nigga, I'm just cutting it. Nigga, ain't you uh-huh. selling all this dope in front of our house? Nigga? Real talk. Yeah, at least. ain't calling the police. Real talk. I'm going to cut her fucking grass. Well, that's just smart. You got to know how to do that smart. shit, though. He kept, the, he kept them people off. <laughs> right. Because yeah. really, she could have been on bullshit. And it wasn't never. I always hustled, but it's just that hustle was never one of them. Grass, nigga? Nah, I ain't never had to cut no grass. Fuck that. But yeah. it's like, hey, I had a man. grass cutting empire. Huh? I had a grass oh, yeah, I know. You the country boy. <laughs> you know what I mean? I, I ain't cut know. all kind of shit. I had, man, that was my, I hated it. But, dog, it's people that real life charge a grip. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. And you'll put your card shit. on there and just you hear me? That's what I'm week. saying. This is how much I hate cutting grass at this point. I done cut so much grass, I wouldn't give a shit if I ever cut grass again for the rest of my fucking life. For real? I, I love cutting grass, grass so much, I'm going to fill my yard up. over concrete. You got the, you got the, <laughs> you got the, the push on or you got you the ride on I'm, I'm so, I'm so much. been through what I've been through. I'm so much. You ain't seen what I seen. I got it. I got my riding lawnmower. I got my weed uh, trimmer. I got my my hedge trimmer, nigga. Oh, I got my goddamn. I got my hedges. When I say, bro, I cut grass, Real bro. Talk. I cut, nigga. I even start giving my my yard the headline, nigga. That's what I'm saying. I ain't not. You hear me? Once you see the nigga yard with the headline, nigga, <laughs> I'm nigga. I'm pulling up like, hey, bro. I ain't just cutting your grass. I'm giving that bitch a headline. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. As soon as you come to my house, damn, Chico, where your hairline at, nigga? You know my shit gone. That's already known. But see, I tried that shit. I, I tried to put like a whole shelf up in my house. 
And you know, before you put shelves up, you're supposed to feel for the uh, stud. The stud that's in the back. So I thought I felt it. Man, I'm nigga, I drilled so many holes in my wall, man. <laughs> But Nigga, I had to get my whole wall done over. I'm like, man, I done put eight not. holes in my wall. But I'm talking not. about, but I got mad. I you got mad because the shit won't go in. I'm like, <laughs> now you know. Now you know how to do it. No, I just called my Mexican so oh, he can come do that shit. Sometimes. Sometimes sometime you need help. Fuck that bullshit. I put eight uh, holes I just, in my wall. <laughs> me personally, I just feel like as men, if we can't learn, if you can't keep picking up shit and keep learning right. shit and doing shit, G, you gonna use. I mean, you wait. just forget yourself. Like you ain't gonna realize what you came up doing. Like your whole life been learning and, and this motherfucker been giving it to you. Real yeah, that's talk, the worst like, shit ever. When you look at some shit, like shit, I could. I know they tired of looking at your talk. ass. Came it's up. Like, I just, yeah, I, just I had to lean back. Man. Man. Spent sorry, it around because I just got sick of that, man. That's you know that nigga don't wear drawers. Yeah, you don't see nothing but a whole ass crack. You're like, you like God damn. The, 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 the good old Navy. That nigga too old for that shit. That's them two for 40s right there. Old folks don't have no draw. They don't two, have no draw draw. They two just for 40 got... old navies right there. Cargo <laughs> pants. That's what them is. Them two that, for 40 old They don't old got damn coals. That's <laughs> the two for 40 old navies. Them cargo. Uh, yeah, they know they got to the sell on the That's a loose back. That's a loose back. <laughs> exactly. The ones that come down to right here, nigga. <laughs> The knuck if you bucks. So that's when you was going that's to the it. club. That's them goddamn, I've been watching it, young girl. <laughs> let me, let me drop you off. <laughs> you know a nigga like, hey, bro, you ain't going to wear no drawers with No, no, you ain't going to wear no drawers with No, these them old navies. <laughs> they don't wear no drawers with Drawers built into these like swim trunks. They <laughs> absorb the sweat. <laughs> <laughs> He they absorb the sweat. sweat. No, you don't supposed to wear no drawers with these. Uh-uh. <laughs> you don't supposed to. They see them. They see them. They see a draw line. <laughs> you don't want to wear this. Oh, shit. <laughs> draw line. Wrong with niggas. You know he's told a nigga. <laughs> no, you don't supposed to wear no drawers with these. I don't know. I don't know why niggas act like they don't feel that little breeze back there. Like, nigga, you know you ain't got no drawers on. Man, what? You <laughs> know you feel that little breeze. They add that. Ah, they just. Bro. Let me see if I can do something up on. Let me see. <laughs> like, my nigga, you feel all that air coming off your ass, man. You gotta man. be a special nigga to wear jeans with no drawers, nigga. Man. <laughs> Fuckers, you ready to shoot a porn, nigga? Why you ain't got no goddamn drawers on? Trip. Fuck wrong with you? This nigga got the porn star going, nigga. Ugh. <laughs> nigga, did you just get out of county jail? <laughs> exactly. He <laughs> finna drop that load on. A robbery bro, victim. If you fuck? ever had a oh, point in your life where you got on some jeans with no drawers, something went wrong. Right. You either shit it and you just don't want nobody to know you shit it in your draw. That's what that is. Either uh, that or you was either. fucking somebody's wife and the husband came home, nigga. You had to leave them bitches. That's it. No, nah, man, we got to get this man up out of here, man. Don't oh, let yeah. this be the last time you nah, come give to it the uh, <laughs> Love, brother. No, nah, don't let this be the last time. No, nah, please you know don't. Got you. Got you. Hold on, so, 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 hold on, hold on. So, so let's make this known fact. This is the first NBA player champion that we've had on the 85 South Coast. Come on, man. Listen. 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 You a goat right now, nigga. Yeah, <laughs> I promise you, niggas don't even have that title. You got it. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you, I got hip to how nice you was with the rapping because we did the uh, BT Cypher the same day last year. And everybody was talking about like how crazy you went. They was talking about, man, y'all niggas went off, but that nigga Mon Shumper did his thing. Man, don't act like they like this shit more than now. They were like, nigga, y'all killed that shit. Uh, they like, who else killed it? Uh, what buddy name? Play basketball. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, man. Put it, put it there, was. man, you know, dude. The you, he, had it, he, had he had the box cut. Yeah, you yeah, know him. Yeah. Yeah. I damn I man. You know I man. That you can win without. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nigga, I, I tell you. See, I ain't know we were like supposed to be filming so tonight. I ain't get the I goddamn know, message till like late. IPhone, nigga, my shit up under this hoodie. Hell no. Woo. Don't give up on it, man. It's over with. I'm what? trying to make a cell phone my damn self. Nah, fuck that. You said hey, iPhone should have gave him a deal. I wanted yeah. iPhone to give him. I was like, I'm in New York. iPhone should make I man. It should be a iPad. Even, oh. A iMan that talk to you. I could be the voice for the series. I could be the I voice. want me an iPhone that way, that way you with an English. That way you can kick it with me. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'd be like, right hey, man, there. bust this left right fast. Instead right. of it be like, turn left 20 feet. Like, man, bust this next left right fast, Joe. Right. 
Yeah. Then when somebody call hey, you, want to talk to. Police, Ooh, I police, swear to God, if this hey, motherfucker goes one more time, police ahead. Get off that bullshit. Shit. If y'all on that bullshit, y'all on that bullshit. Y'all on that bullshit. Tighten up. They say police ahead. Like, Tighten up. I thought that would be cool. I, I definitely would have had that GGM. Still should come out with the Batman. That's dope. Just a black series. Just put that shit. Yeah, but then they get a piece of it. Yeah, they get a piece of it. 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 They get I'm way shit, too that familiar. Put you at, that put you at the field. Shit, you I stay down. Knew, I knew I didn't trust myself in that regard. I'm like, man, if I, that's what it is. Yeah, if I live at the crib, gee, I'm gonna feel like I got two. I'm gonna feel like I got superpowers. So y'all can't say nothing. Y'all can't move. I'm moving. Y'all can't do nothing. Champion. Y'all can say whatever. Yeah, I would feel like what you gonna do? Oh. He going crazy. I'm what man. number would you be? Hawks mm. jersey. Nah. Oh, I like that now. I can see now. it. I Ooh, why. I can see it too. You look oh, like you Jersey. reminiscing ah! after the 12 championships. You can... What? Because they're going to blow him up. Nah. Superstar. Real talk. Iman Shum. Championship. He's going to bring us all the champions. Nah. Go play for the Hawks. That's right. The biggest happy. Happy. You ain't going to get your ass no help. Listen. You're going to be your little brother again. No, I'm like, bro, they hired me too. But you know what I mean? I feel like if you come here, you can actually do exactly what you said. Like, they don't really, I mean, cause don't get me wrong, my, 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 my boy going doing the thing, ice cold, Trey, he doing the thing, but we need leadership, we need guidance, we need somebody to actually guide that team, and you know exactly, well, first of all, you got the ring, hey, <laughs> that's going to put you above going everything what's going on. That's how, that's how I was in Sacramento. That. In Sacramento, <clears throat> we was balling, Jesus. We like, need that. It's a vibe that I'm going I'm to bring a vibe, G. Right. I'm going to bring a, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I'm going to make it feel like home to me, G. I, I, sometimes it's, it, it might seem like too much to people sometimes, but whatever it is, like I just feel like I'm going to get down how I get down. If they rock with me, they rock with me. If they don't, they don't. But I told you, I love that moment of that, you know what I'm saying? I treat this shit like a girl on the street, G. I love that moment when you got to walk across the street. Hey, hey, shorty. Right. And your guys is over there and her home girl's right there. She might do you like a lane. Right. Or... She gonna do like how the girls do at that party when they dancing and they you grab a hand and they dance for a second and they stop. <laughs> <laughs> they already looked at their friends to see if you they then they turn around, that's that moment of truth. And they turn around and they like what's going on, then they really start, I love that moment. Right. You know what I'm saying? I done took an L in that moment before. Well, she done left me sitting there like, oh no, I don't do that. I like light <laughs> I like light skinned niggas actually. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? Shit, they got dead with yourself. <laughs> It's that new move <laughs> by yourself. It's the solo. It's the solo. Call that bitch the I Man. That's what you do. <laughs> 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 Nigga, fuck that bitch. I'm doing the I Man. Fuck you, Tony. Bust left. Bust <laughs> right now, y'all. <laughs> Real talk, though. No, like, I love that moment. So it just be like, gee, I got to get down. I get down. That's a cold ass moment right there. Bro. Right. When, when they don't like you. <laughs> they'll act like you. Hey, dog. They'll act like you. They can be. Or they dance, they be like, actually, I don't want to dance. But nigga, with a titty. Yeah, that's what's up. All right, I'm in the church. I'm not dancing. You got to go to the bathroom when you get shut down. Yes. You be like, you know what? Real really? talk. But that's Let me I reset. Never, I don't even like the bathroom. I kind of <laughs> like the whole, like, niggas like, oh, she turned them down. Like, I ain't tripping. Like, I win a lot. You see what I'm saying? So it just be like, but I, shit. but I take the I, L, it be like, cool, joke on me. But at least y'all see us. This is regular nigga shit, bro. We, Way more we wins all, than loss. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to win again. You got to laugh through the like, loss. Shorty Miss, she might have been, she might have took the L on this road. I know it's a couple of Jones that's probably like, damn, that nigga was trying to talk to
and I just I thought he was running games. No, nah, bitch, do your e man. Come on. But they be like, I'm you man. see the you see I'm the man. shit, you see the shit now, and it just be like, they'll be like, damn, he say all this shit about Tiana. Woo -woo. Tiana believed everything I said. She like, I like that you coming like that. Like after a while, she just like that. Just this, this is really him. It's all that's just how he get down, and I like it. So cool. And it was like, she believed everything I say. It's like sometimes. Motherfucker just gotta really put it out there. You gotta have that moment where she might think you a lame, bro. Or she might think you a lame today. You don't know if you're gonna see her tomorrow. If you see her tomorrow, she might have seen me in my, you know what I'm saying, in my sweats after I worked out. And she wasn't fucking with me in a do rag. That's the bad plan. Nah. But then you might see me walk out the stove with, you know what I'm saying, wearing that shit. With that sauce on. Smelling like I'm supposed to smell. You know what I'm saying? You see me the next day and you like, oh, and you see what I hop in, you like, oh, you oh got yeah. It. I got oh, it. Oh, now, miss. You mean to catch that exhaust pipe? Ah! That's correct. <laughs> it's a rat. But it just be like, dog. I love that moment, man. I, that just, shit, like that's. I like if anybody ever asked me, like, why you be rapping and shit? Like, I'm chasing. I'm chasing that feeling, bro. I'm chasing the feeling of standing on the stage, cause that's what basketball is. Right. We standing on the stage. Going crazy. Trying to bro. see if y'all fuck with me. I just want to know if y'all fuck with me. That's the only reason we care if the fans is there. Why you think niggas is doing three-point celebrations? Do y'all fuck with me? That's all it is. And it's like, with the music shit, can I say something that make all y'all niggas feel like, yep, I know that I, that's exactly how I felt. I walked in here the exact same way. Can I say something like that? And Or can I not? Can right. it be a bunch of niggas be like, that shit was trash? <laughs> but is it going to be trash in a week when I say it? Right. It's going to be trash when I'm, when I'm 30 now and I'm, it match up? Right. You know what I'm saying? Is it going to be trash? I don't know, but I got to put the real estate out there. Like I said, at some point, they're going to have to rent a house. I keep Jeez. throwing that in there just so y'all just yeah, go, go own, as much, in the sky. <laughs> own as much of the real estate as you can Talk in the sky, shit. man. Own the land here. They ain't making no more land, y'all. You know what I'm saying? They making a lot of chains. They ain't making no more land. Just tap in. Talk you know? your shit. Get an acre you know for like 20 get? bands. You know what I'm about to get? <laughs> I'm about to get that. a motherfucking chain with my land on that bitch. <laughs> I'ma have my shit. This an ignorant chain with my properties on that bitch. I'ma have the whole layout. Get, get, I already had the nigga. I already had the nigga. I already had the nigga fly over on the helicopter and take the picture of the shit. Damn, coordinates to your land. With nothing have my shit right there, nigga. Talk though. No, you might have. How about land a chain now? with some of my dirt on that bitch? God damn, you need to wash that motherfucker. Some dirt from my land, iced oh, out dirt. Not, not dirt I thought you were talking about dirt around your neck. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Put the dirt on the chain. Hey, chain with the dirt around that motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. What's that on that chain? No, it's real. I mean, it's gonna be on his neck. Dirt. His neck gonna be dirty. His neck gonna be dirty. That shit gonna stink. Dirt ass, neck ass. Oh, nigga, man. You, you gonna need some of that NBA soap for that. Yeah. <laughs> nah, nigga. You gonna need, you need NBA soap for that. You need to bathe with your chain one day, motherfucker. What you talking about? I'm coming. Just know you don't need that smooth I'm a, groove boss soap for that, man. I'll be the first nigga to put my land on the chain. Just know that. <laughs> yeah, you heard really. it here first, motherfucker. Get the real estate in the side, man. Sky. Uh, all, all of, I, when I do be talking on my music, they be always asking me, like, who I'm talking to. I'm just talking to that young nigga that was like me, bro. Right. It's more me in the world than your favorite artist, bro. I guarantee it. It's more niggas that wanted to hoop, rap, make the clothes they win had all these ideas, and at some point somebody told them that my ideas was a little too big, just ho focus on hooping. They did that. They still want to do this. They just, right now, that's all they know. Right. I just was that kid, just like y'all, like, I didn't know which one was going to hit. But I'm, I'm like, I'm going to do them all, love. you know what I'm saying? Like, do I don't shit. know what's going to hit. But when I told my mom I was going to get that house, I didn't say it had to be NBA money. Right. I right. didn't say that. I said, I'm going to get you this house. I said I was gonna go to the league, I said I was gonna get the ring, but I said I was gonna get you this house. I didn't say I was gonna get you this house with NBA money. Right. I did. But <laughs> if I didn't, I still was gonna get her that house. Fuck and that's the up. that's the hustle, that's the drive that I want people to resonate with. Like when they listen to the Joyride, that's the name of the project, the Joyride. When they listen to it, I want them to just like just turn that motherfucker on, do what you gotta do. You gotta light your fire, light your fire. You mm -hmm. gotta drink your drink, like drink your drink. But when you listen to it, G, just don't. Don't see me in a jersey for a second. Just mm. yeah. pretend I ain't even make it, bro. Right. Like, just, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I hoop, bro. But it's a job. Just like everybody else got a job. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just want niggas to just turn it on and listen to see, do I fuck with him? Don't, don't ask, don't say, 
let me listen to this basketball player that rap. I, right. I want to see if he the best NBA rapper. Right. Now you would, you ain't even listening to me. Right. You just seeing who you <clears> like. Perception more. is all this nigga. You fucked is, up. He's yeah. the basketball player that's rapping right now. Yeah, when you hear it, just. Right, because everybody knows Scotty Pippen was the greatest NBA rapper. So. <laughs> Scotty Pippen sounds like a slave. You the only, only one that heard that mixtape. Oh, oh y'all ain't heard Scotty Pippen. You the Pippen only one that heard Scotty Yeah, because you don't be around enough, motherfucker. For real? He got a, he got a mid Yeah, don't listen to this thing. Man, man. Man. I really like don't playing fall. with the Bulls. Yeah. I really do. Don't he probably for his bullshit. Put one out. I really do. Just because he said that. Just because he said that. I knew somebody knew I was fucking around. But he may rap. He may. You know who he'll never do a song with? I know. Ooh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> damn, got it. Hey, welcome back to the 85 South hey, Show. <laughs> no, nah, on some real shit. We're not going to keep you up in here all night, Nah, but as long as I ever helped this blunt. For I, real, I, for I, real, I really, bro. I mean, I, I'm, I'm your friend. friend. I'm really your friend really right now. Friend, I've been man. like to him. Hey, yeah, though, that's man. dope, though, that y'all did that. Y'all held it down, man. I know yeah. y'all want to. But that's yeah. another thing. Like, I, I told you, I want to try and break that barrier. That's what the mixtape for, bro. Right, man. Right. This mixtape, DJ Drama hosted it, bro. Fucking yeah. right. Like, Gangsta Grills. It's a Gangsta Grills entry. Like, it's like the perfect excuse for niggas to be like, all right, I always wanted to know what he was like without the mask on. Mm -hmm. Like, this is mask off, he Just, you know what I'm saying? Just. I just want niggas to listen to it, see if they fuck with it, man. You know what I'm saying? Fuck with it. We know I can't wait. I can't wait. Definitely see you fuck with it. it. I can't wait. I wish he sent me this beat for the mixtape. He can. Yeah, send it. Go. Send it to him. I wish I had this. Oh, it's, oh it's shit. Man, man, man. I didn't even know you got we'll the We'll make sure he send you a part of too. Yeah. That's done what's already. up, nigga. Yeah, he got it. Y'all can listen to it. Oh, it's a I need it. It's already out. Yeah, drop something right quick for DC, man. I need it. Drop something right quick play while that we one. on the outro. Any Matter of fact, any more play Dior. Videos? Play Dior. Nah, it's not the, that's it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Dior. I know motherfuckers wondering why I got this goddamn hood on, nigga. I ain't know what he's doing this shit. Oh, shit. My shit is on Shaquille Sunflower up <laughs> this motherfucker. No, let me see. Hey! <laughs> well, you look like my daddy, bro. Daddy! I fuck with you for getting there though. He say, man, I gotta get here with my dogs, man. I gotta get there. Yeah, nigga, I ain't know we was doing it. Nigga, like we shooting tonight, Chico. I'm like tonight. I'm thinking I'm being incognito. Hey, hey, hey. True story. I'm hey, way here. come here. This Listen. shit look like a weather forecast. You hear me? It's look like it's gonna be a tornado right here. My Please shit is all here. over the place. Listen. Oh, no, y'all. Well, like, man, no, nah, nigga, we been know what it look like. I don't give a fuck. Well, this is a point. tornado storm coming around South Carolina region right here. <laughs> then a tsunami is coming around the curve. <laughs> you see my shit coming back in the middle, nigga. Y'all ain't shit. Whatever. <laughs> man, I, I ain't know we was doing this. Listen, I'm in the gas station, right, thinking I'm incognito with the mask on. This little boy said, Mommy, they go Chico Bean. She was like, that ain't no Chico Bean. He said, uh-huh, look at his hair. He the only one with that. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> You got me, little man. That shit crazy, game yeah. violence. It's in there. It's in there. You see it. Both of y'all niggas look like two exhibits. Y'all niggas tripping. <laughs> nah, this is the after right here. This, this nigga, he still nah, got that's all exhibit. Oh, that's the exhibit. That's the exhibit. You did the Oh, you did it. You did the transfer shit. Huh? I ain't doing nah, nigga. I'm just letting this shit grow. Fuck oh, it. That's crazy. My shit been fucked up. I'm Let me see the other side, though, Chief. Oh, this side? No, no, nigga. This side. George Jefferson. That's right what I'm oh, saying. Yeah. Like, I'm like, why you. Nigga, AI, George Jefferson. You just on some fuck the haircut shit. AI, George Jefferson. And nigga, who you shit like that? Georgia. Shit like that. It's like, nigga, hey, I, niggas Georgia. is allowed to do that, bro. Oh, I'm allowed to do whatever I want. That's a, that was the whole point, just to show, nigga, I do what I want to. Fuck it. But nigga, I know my shit look crazy. I look like I professionally I, I, thought, I thought you was like trying to do the shit where they trans. No, no, nah, I ain't doing Hell that. No. I don't even know what that motion was. You just did. What's the one when they, they go take, and like, bring I your shit? Take the hell follicles bro, you and two hell. niggas yeah, at one time. You hear me, right? You was a young look, nigga, old nigga. Shaquille I, Sunflower. I, nigga. I feel like I'm old. Najee Rumble. If I even try to explain why. Nah, please explain. I need what's your perspective. You done seen a lot of you from you playing in the league. You bro, you look like an old nigga, bro. Shut up. Why the nigga look like one of them old fuck it, principles? I, I, right. Yeah, Listen. Yeah. This your third time getting spit it. I'm gonna kick you out. Come on, mama. That shit's that you got the Mr. Clock. That though. nigga. All the, nah, that ain't the Mr. Clock. It's the nigga that was with Mr. Clock. Contrary to popular belief, I'm the head nigga in charge. Oh mama. <laughs> That's this right here on this side. And then on this side, I got the NBA street this still, nigga. Bro, listen, you have to do a skit where your shit is full like that. But then it's like literally skit right here in the middle. I can do that towards the end That's whenever I'm about to cut it. Yeah. But right now, we doing all the different styles. I'm going to get my like style tomorrow. 65 on this side. <laughs>
Two Face. He look like a deacon. Nigga, this nigga, I had no crazy. idea. That nigga Chad hit me like, yeah, we filming today. I'm like, stop taking this shit out. Nigga, this shit right here no. is halfway done. Your yeah. ass is hey, hey, man. Man. Jefferson. You won. Yeah, you you won, nigga, won. of the pandemic. <laughs> oh, but without question. Pandem- pandemic has definitely went through you. Right? Been, right. You've been the most exciting nigga this whole time, bro. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Ain't nobody did shit. You won. Confidence, all time high. Nigga, you need to just walk in the stores and just look at motherfuckers and be like, this is life. Y'all gonna have to get through it. Hey, man. You won, nigga, the pandemic. Man, close us out, bro. Hey, listen. <laughs> Which side you want me to close us both out? Both sides. You gotta side? do both sides. You gotta do both sides, bro. All right, now I wanna thank everybody for tuning in to the 85 South, bro. We got Iman Shumpert here. He got a little aggressive when he balled his fist up. That's just because he's passionate right there. I want to thank everybody for watching and listening and everybody that's doing what they did and keep doing what you're doing. Iman, thank you so much. <laughs> Don't laugh too hard, my brother. I'm just trying to give the we, the people what they need in regards to paying attention to what you, what's the name of your project that's coming out? The Drawer. The Drawer. I don't know what he said. The Drawer. The Drawer. The Drawer. The Drawer. The Drawer. The I'm sorry. You got to speak up, young boy. I don't know nothing about what you're talking about. The Drawer. Take a joy ride when you come out with the project. I want to thank everybody for tuning in to the 85 South Show. My name is Chico, Marvin, <laughs> and I want to thank everybody for just paying attention and watching. It feels good to be back. All right, this side. Hey, man. Nah, nah, nah. Fuck all that clapping, nigga. This the braid side. Y'all niggas, man. Y'all got me fucked up, dog. Niggas be talking shit. You need to cut that shit. Fuck y'all niggas. Nigga, this 2020. This is how I'm coming. Talk to somebody. Yeah. Hey, the guy stop doing you did. Yeah. We out this bitch. Y'all niggas, man. Yeah, you down the fuck. I don't okay, fuck, you man. can't just give anybody a microphone. <laughs> <laughs> These niggas, man, I fuck with y'all, y'all. Real talk. Ooh, we was talking about that shit before y'all came. We all nigga, they gave y'all that auto tune. And y'all niggas was like, oh, uh, everything. That shit changed the game. That's why I do about it. That shit changed the game. Look, niggas. That shit changed the game. Boy.